Africa? Africa? What is what is wrong with you? Are you okay? Feeling dizzy. You're feeling my goodness. Africa, I thought I asked you not to wash the cars. Look, I wanted to take them to car wash. Why? Africa, why did you why, why did you put yourself through all this stress? Okay. I want to look at more now. I want I want I want to ask you my salad. Please imagine. Yes. Where is that cook? Edna! Edna! Yeah. Please come, come, come. Please, look at this, look at this young man. Ah! What happened to him? I asked him not to wash the cars and he insisted. Just imagine now. Oh my goodness. I'm rushing off to the office, okay? Just take care of him. Give him whatever he needs. In fact, look, that pharmacy is uh, down the street. Make sure you go there and get drugs for him, okay? I'll see you when I come back. Okay. What happened to you? I said that way they asked him to see me. Wow. I'm going to pay for my job. I need to be serious for once. Tell me what you want to eat and I'm going to make it for you. I'm not sure. I'm going to tell you to give me what I want. So I'll bring pepper and my right hand. Eh. Should I bring a long note or short note? I'll bring hardback. Hardback. I'm coming. I'll bring hardback for. So that you feel here, feel here, feel here for the things you want to eat at once. I'm bringing them now. Let's go with possible. Let us talk that is Hey! What is it? Where your toilet? I got what you define. Snake, enter here. Snake. Don't joke, I'm a man of God. Snake, enter here. Where your toilet? There. There? Yes. You know, say snake and. Why, why they fight toilet? Snake and toilet are five and six. The spirit is telling me that the snake is in your toilet. This is that side. That side. Okay, why is there? I never see the snake. Oh. Hey. Yes, ma'am. What is this way? But I flushed the toilet. Sorry, what? I killed the snake properly. Whoa, 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 wait, too. Don't tell me you went to my personal executive toilet to mess things up there. Brother, no verse. It'll be hook you. I'll just go upload. Thank you very much. You know, you know, you know, you know, say, I think you kill you now. Not only that. What's your magic they do? Kind of knife, but I think you. No verse, not only that I go. No bizarre do anything. No verse. So you don't go fish. Yes. You flush away. I go now. Thank right. you very much, eh? Bye. But for uh, allowing a man of God to offload. I want to. I got the gun! You know that if you pray for me now, with this your gun now, we'll do it like this. If you pray for me now, I got the ones that than this. So go. They enjoy you. Huh? Only you they drink too many. Just share, man. I will like keep it. Of I got your gun, man. I wasted my time. I, 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 I defied you. Calm down, man. I think only one. I never chop today. No verse. Wait. You shoot for my executive toilet. You don't know, flush and wear. You still won't call it one. Help the needy now. In giving, you receive. Look, I just call it one. Because I'm not a better person. No, I don't know. Why call it one? Take this one out. Take this thing. Make it very good. Very. In fact, do you know what? My God bless you. My God. Hey, don't care. The God. My God will lift you. My God will adore you. The God. Your God, your God, your God, your God. I want to pray for you. Need them. Pray for who? Just need them now. Listen. You never teach her. You you suppose don't change that your church with the God. Tell her today like beggar. Okay. Don't give up for your church. You know if you just use hundred or two hundred thousand, take by take by time. Forget the messenger and listen to the message. I gotta go. Hello, hello, minister, minister. Hello, minister. I am going to bring my bride over, my wife. <laughs> ah! So you're getting married?
married? Yes, I'm getting married. Oh, hey, God is good. Oh, wow. All the time. <laughs> All the time. God is good. Hell. Oh. Wow. Mm. This is great news. Oh my goodness. I can't wait to see the apple of your eyes. So <laughs> once again, congratulations. Thank you. Thank you very much. Don't worry, you'll see her very soon. Mm. It's very good. In that case, my work here is almost done. Once she comes back, on my way out. Why is I mean, says who? I don't it, understand. Is it not the way it is done? You're getting married. Before she enters here, she'll be the one to make your food. I thought that is where people do it. No, 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 no. Edna, look. It might be the way they do it out there, okay? But certainly not in my house. I mean, what if she's a bad cook? She won't be a bad cook. Oh, please. Edna, I have grown fond of your personality and your food. Okay, so if my wife must cook for me, she must learn from you. Sam, I'm honored. <laughs> Thank you so much, sir. Thank You're you, welcome. Sir. You're welcome. And mm -hmm. uh, enough of this, your sad, 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 sad thing. I mean, I've told you before, I'm tired of it already. Sorry, sir. Yes. Sorry, sir, friend. Don't worry. <laughs> I'll learn how to say it well. All right. Later. <laughs> okay, you can. Uh, so let me do the dishes, oh? No problem. Congratulations again. Thank you very much. Ashamed of yourself. Pity for your body. Do oh. you remember the kind of the kind of food I gave you? The quantity, large quantity, large chunk, with the drinks. Yet you're coming again to ask for food. Me alone will get better before you grab one. This stomach. Oh, I don't like this thing. 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 I don't like I'm just telling you about the dangers of eating late. You're raising your voice. Eh, uh, keep it for yourself. I am good. I will give the food done done. You bring them. I go come collect them. Look at this boy. Very soon, this boy will be able to walk again. Look at the way he's walking like a masculine. Tamon, sharam, sharam, sharam. This is the moment we force. Africa. Africa. Oh. How are you? Uh, good morning. And how are you? Here, you have your salary. Oh, thank you, sir. I increased your salary for you a bit. Look, I I'm sorry it's taken this long, okay, to get a new kit man. But not to worry. Okay, before the end of this month, I will definitely get someone who will replace you. I mean replace you and drink so that you can mind your houseboy duties. Okay. You're not supposed to be bothering now. I can do the job while you do the payment. And I see when do. <laughs> it is not as in when do. Okay? It is as in when do. You. As in when do. You. <laughs> Say as in when do. You. <laughs> okay, you don't kill me laughing this time. But no. Okay, I am certainly getting someone who will replace you. I mean, someone who will replace you call is the one that left. I need you to mind your job as husband while he minds the gates for me. Alright? I'm not complaining. I'm not... Hey, hey, enough. It's not for the gate, okay? Take it for me. Prepare something sumptuous. I mean, something very, very delicious that my bride will eat as soon as we return. Excuse me, sir. S sorry, sorry. Sorry, sir. Don't be angry. Uh, this trip you're making, are you returning on Saturday or on Sunday? Do you never let me plan what to cook? Edna, for heaven's sake, I'm not supposed to return on Saturday. The wedding is on Saturday. 
So I'm coming back on Sunday, I mean a day after the wedding. Okay. Sorry. Um, here. Have this. Okay. I mean, this should be um, more than enough. Okay, I needed to use this to prepare something very, very delicious. I mean, a mouth-watering meal that my bride will enjoy as soon as we return. It's very important. For her alone? Yeah. Now, of course, it's not for her alone. It's for everybody. I mean, we're all celebrating. Okay? okay? You make something that will be enough for everybody in the house. Alright? Especially that, um, that acrylic of a boy. You know, it's too much. You just made a point. You don't think it's about time we checkmated what that acrylic puts into his mouth? For Christ's sake, that boy is already obese. It's good we cut what he eats, especially sugar. Or what maka diabetes. Because the way he's bloating up and getting round, oh, he now you become sick. Right now he's just a boy, okay? I mean, he's just a little boy. You know how old he is. He is just a boy for crying out loud. So give him the benefit of the doubt. I mean, before he gets of age, all those fat, everything will just disappear. Okay, sir. Okay? Um, but um, I concur to what you said. I mean, you are right. Oh. Uh, we have to ration his food. I and mean, you have to ration his food, but not starving him completely. Hell! So this is the best thing you have said now. Hell! Thank you, sir. Do you know I support that rationing of food for him, sir? By starving him before you know that boy begins to steal. You know his eyes are sharp. But you know it's the theater had killed the boy. Hey, now you're never going to stop calling me, sir, are you? Sorry, sir. You are still calling me, sir. Oh. Listen, Edna, you are like my auntie. Okay, and considering your age, I am not comfortable with this sir, 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 sir thing. I mean, come off it already. Sorry, Please. Sir. Can you stop? Thank you. Please. I rather prefer you call me Fred. Oh, sorry, sir. No, 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 already. Fred, I, I promise I'll make something nice. She will love it. I trust you. Mm -hmm. Alright, you take care of yourself. Are you serious? Yes, sir. Hey, Lord is my shepherd. I'm ready. Is it Mr. You get one guy where they stay here before you go to my man. You never know, cool. But this way is this tea for my girl. So, all the two my girl, my girl, manage the boat after all. Money, but they come double money. No, no, you cannot be managing the boat. You see, people where they call Okul. Ah, I'm robber. They can thief where we're. Okul. All the Okul is why I know that thieves. Right. Hey. I know. Yeah, but you know, we tell you, I say, when you do get man, they do hands blood. That is blocking someone's success now. Let me do the get man. She I tell you my story. No job, street rough. Look at they do the get man, I beg. No, I your, your story touched me. Uh, I, I, I will subless the job to you. Thank you very much. Thank you very, very much. Wow. My mother. That's your no understand. <laughs> I will give you the job. Like, I will subless them. I don't say no good. I will try to talk say, if they pay your salary, I will take my own share for you. In fact, I will collect your money on your behalf. Then pay you off. So if they collect money on my behalf, you could they do the work too on my behalf. I mean I'm going to work with the collecting money. Bless you know this show. You go leave this compound now. How you gonna how I gonna work? You're you gonna collect salary. No, sir. I see the child you. No, sir, no. Go leave. No, this. No, this. Acrica 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 Or, 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 or
Tu vă minga la dimă. Iar aia nu dai, cum o să văd. Îmi zis așa. Don't you dare insult me. I'll slap your face. You was so good to talk it. Are you mad? Are you crazy? What's wrong with you? Hai să pară că în cea? Vigă, vigă. Ala nu. Nu, nu, nu. Look at this fool! Look at this idiot! You brought a stranger into a house you don't even own! There are even a proper servant there! And I'm cautioning you! You're opening your mouth to insult me! Don't you know that I'm old enough to be your mother? No, I was a grandma. But that was when I was. Let go. You stressed my life. I give you five minutes. Go and send that stranger away. Else I will come and send him away myself. You cannot. If you do that, I'm sorry. No, no. He has been I have been respecting you in this house. But since you don't deserve my respect, I don't want to respect yourself. Okay, I'm in for anything. If you fuck with me, I give you. I'll beat you. I'll slap you. Don't insult me. Don't insult me. I'm not your mate. Don't insult me. I'll just slap you here and I'll not do anything. You are so new. You know what I mean. I'm working. No, no, you're not working. I'm working. I'm working. I'm working. I'm working. See, I was doing something important before you interrupted. Then we can finish my business. So you're part of men. Business. You're discussing business. I'm going for a business. Get away! No, no. You're working. I was discussing business. So, 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 Don't be that. Cook or don't be nonsense. Madam, when I get cook, Anna, who wonder you? I wait for you. When I get cook, what you gonna do? You gonna stay away from me? Okay. To come. Yeah. Uh huh. No problem, man. Abi. You just stay away from this. Come back. Come back. So how this area? What are they get? What are they get like here, steady? Go go na. Ha. They get like steady. If they fuck up, then they. If we are finish and I don't get steady, I go buy another food. Invest and this. Eh. Yes, man. We get it. Like how many times on the chop for here a day? On the normal, they the chop three times. But me, very don't who I be. On the chop twelve times a day. You the chop twelve times a day. Day your body. Have you chopped three in the morning? Chopped three in the afternoon? Chopped six in the night? Chopped three in the night? Then chopped three in midnight? How are you? I'm fine. There is this friend of mine that I want you to help. You want me to help? Yes, and like by giving him the gift, man. Oh, oh, oh. You found someone already? Yes, sir. He's my friend, sir. Wow, that's beautiful. So, when is this your so called friend coming so I can assess him? If not for assessing, I trust this guy. Even there, yes, sir. Here? Yes. Okay. The baby! The baby! My dad, I'll come back home. You don't come back. Good day, sir. Good day. Uh, you are Dubem, sir. Dubem. Are you sure you can do this job? Yes, sir, I can. I can, sir. Sure? I can, sir. I don't always sleep in on duty. I don't sleep on duty, sir. Just don't pay me for the first one month. Let me prove what I can do. All right, no problem. Uh, tomorrow morning I'll get some documents to sign. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you very much, sir. Appreciate it. Thank you, sir. 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 
Thank you. you. You found this in my room? Where yeah, else? In your room? Down there? I don't know what would have happened to my wife to be seized this. Ah, my goodness. Edna, thank you. Thank you so much. I, I am indeed grateful. Uh, uh, one more thing. Is there anywhere something like this is hidden or locking anywhere so that we can sort it out and remove them? Um. I can't, I can't, I can't say for sure. Jessica was the only girl I had any relationship with. And although she belongs to my past now. And Jessica is a very careless person. So please, I will need you to scan everywhere. Okay, scan all the rooms, scan the sitting room to make sure that something like this don't repeat itself again. No problem. Please. I will do that. I will search everywhere to destroy everything that has to do with your past. Thank you. Marriage is a new beginning, so it should begin well. So Thank you so much, Edna. I should destroy this? Yes, please, please, okay. destroy it. No problem. Destroy it, please. Okay, and um, Edna, mm -hmm. thank you. No thank you for always having my back. Mm -hmm. You're my boss. I'll always have your back, sir. Thank you so much. Excuse me, let me go destroy this one. <sighs> Good morning, sir. Good morning. I, I hope you slept well. Yes, I slept well. Only say mosquito nearly finished me for night. Mosquitoes? From where? Oh, there are no mosquitoes in this estate, okay? If we get this estate regularly, so there are no mosquitoes. I wonder where that mosquito yeah. you're talking about is coming from. Oh, you know, you last night. Why? I ordered him to leave. You ordered him to leave? Yes, sir. I thought I told you he's employed already, so why don't you allow him to sleep over? Uh, it, 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 no problem, sir. Me, sir, I, I be one good eye yesterday because I don't say I can arrange myself. Come here early moment. So, no problem. All right, no problem. Um, all right. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, wait. No, that's for us. Okay. Go ahead. Yes, sir. No problem. No problem. Um, two liters, trying to make this again. Yes, sir. I'm making love. I'm feeling. Okay, sir. Thank you very much for the job what you give me, sir. I promise to deliver. I will work wholeheartedly. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. Okay. Um, when next you're coming to my city, make sure you dress properly. Okay, no okay, don't worry. I will make sure I have um I get the teller to get you your uniform. You go show uniform for me? Yes. I mean you have to dress properly if you want to work for me. Uh, thank you, sir. Uh, thank you, sir. We go in my arm, we go in my my cabinet. I mean my Let me feel it tongue. Sir. He can neither read nor write. Yes. He had his growing up mainly in the village, so you don't need to blame him. 
for a young man like that. I mean, that is strange. Are you sure he can do the job? Yes, sir. He's a vigilante in my village, and I've had good records about him. So I'm sure he can do the job. Well, all right, no problem. But um, I can listen. I'm only employing that young man because you are standing for him. Thank you. Are you sure he can do the job? He can do the job. Yes, All right, fine. I'll be traveling to the village immediately. Okay, so let him start. If I let him start right away, okay, I want to see him at the gate as I'm leaving. Okay. Okay? Mm -hmm. All right, sir. Thank you. Um, Africa, thank you very much for making the search of the gate man easy for me. Okay? <laughs> I don't need to mention Helping people is in my blood, is in my nature, <laughs> is in my gene. All right. Go back to your duty post, okay? Thank Let me see you in the cook. Okay? Half an hour. Half an hour. You go away, go. See, they're successfully hired. In fact, you are officially hired. Thank you, Jesus! I'm officially hired. Ah. Sorry. So what put down the, the, the template so I don't chop Sorry, I was excited. Sorry. When they get your pass, they will give you job. Ah, see, now I tell you, never take this thing as a direct employment. Show your nose and I will bring you call. And no say that side in my side inside. Once the money land, I will collect I will collect the money to give you your own. No problem. Oh my father. Eh, I want that thing. This instruction one I won't give you. It's very, very important. Yeah. Never collect any gift or any kind from a guy. Even if you don't mistakenly collect her, show me so that I can decide if you have it or not. Sure you understand? No problem. Any other thing? Uh, what you will do is that the best thing, you won't go collect uh, um, paper form, paper uh, side, where you know say I did it. No, no, no verse, no verse. No verse, eh? Hi. So I'm officially hired. Uh, no, I just go your duty phone. Me, you know, say I love the gift man again. Go to the dead, sir. Very soon, they go still bring your costume. I'm bringing the job two of times a day. Like, you know, you say, no, let me get that opportunity. Why don't you go and insult me at will? He said, don't stick my command. He's always saying, I do not pay his salary, and I do not, I do not go, go on this house with you. And you're just telling me this now? It's just pissing me off. I've been keeping it away from you because I do not want to ruin the relationship you have with him. I do not want anything to come between that. Edna, I don't have any relationship with Akrika rather than the working relationship we have. Nothing more, nothing less. He works for me. Okay, sir. I mean, why would Akrika insult you? He's not aware that you're old enough to be his mother. I don't know. That boy has run jam. Edna, I will tolerate every other thing from Africa. Is he insulting you? I will never tolerate it from him. I will handle this as soon as I come back. No problem. Careful, sir. You take care of the house. Okay? Thank you very much. You know how village people are. Be careful. Oh, be careful. That's you, that's you, that's you, that's you, Moisa. Why are you calling me that, that? Do I look like fire? Hey, please, call me your guy instead. Okay? Hey, you know, we say, don't be like that. You know, say, Oga, anybody where they feed anybody for this harsh economy. And the person that it be that now. <laughs> Quite a joke. You know, we say, for the fear and respect why I get for our Lord Jesus Christ. And for they call you Jesus. <laughs> Please. Enough of this, you comedy. Enough. Look, I'm, I'm traveling, okay? I'm traveling to the village. Make sure you take care of the house, okay? I'll see you when I return. Oh, God, I will be here now. No worry, no worry. I'm in charge. You can't give me a little bit. You can't just give me a little bit. You can't 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 give me a little bit. You I had an agreement with you, I got to rush on your That person you saw there? That is your new food. So that you to help you uh, uh, shape this SS part. No, you're fat! No, you're fat! I don't know the large rooms, so I don't really like that kind of thing. You have a heart attack, people fat like this will easily have a heart attack. 
What is a lie? I don't like that kind of thing. Who cares about what you like and what you don't like? Huh? Whether you like it or not, that is your new portion of food. And that is what we continue to eat. Are you the like Eat it if you don't like it. Be hungry. Is it even better you're hungry so that you shed this? Look at your breath. Now you're fat. Look at your own belly. Yeah. Oh, they will blame you now. I got the blame. Yeah. Why can't you carry you for the sun? Well, no, say that when you get hungry. As you provide food, I go, go, go out and go buy food for you. Come carry you. See this insult. Seriously? Stop, Stop it. Once Oga comes back, we'll address this insult. Because I will not know how to treat likes like you. I will not give you the new Oga um, get man food. Which, which get man? So now that there's a new get man in the house. I am giving you this food. That's what. Next time, I won't. He will come inside and take his food. Let me go do something with his lips. I'm wasting this my time. Oh, 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 Why are you going to cut my food now? If, if, if anyone is supposed to have more food here, it's me because I'm bigger than you. I don't understand. No, who bring this work? Come. Who bring this job? Come. See, if you are not obey yourself, then this bitch can leave. That's all you die with the So sorry, understand. Sorry, no verse. No verse. But this is unfair now. You are cutting my food and it's still intimidating me. It's unfair. No me they pay you. If I may tell you, for this house, if anything comes to you, you must pass to me. I will tell you, even if not water, you go, even if not food, or even if not money, you will pass to me. But if person wants you to like, like bullet, you must not pass to me. If you go direct, go to get to money. No worry. Sorry if I'm being ungrateful. No problem. Your boy is not here. They, they bring my food. If they bring my food, you cut. If they bring my salary, you cut. Anything we cut, no problem. Bless like you, not the wrong. Hey! Why do you think you're going? You disrespectful thing. You know what? I'm going to stop, bro. And I'm going to check. Where are you going? I won't go for that food now. Show you, say, no food there. So I won't come back by myself. The one you cooked, manager. Look at you. How you're coming with full confidence to open the kitchen I manage. When I say there is no food, there is no food for a disrespectful idiot like you, fool. And as well, ever again in this house, you will not eat. I don't even understand you, chef. Mm. She has to say, don't they get pride to serve me? I'm take my, my food by myself now. Uh. Eh. Eh. You will not eat any food I prepared until you learn some respect. Mm? That's what when you go and train yourself. That's not easy for me. I should have said, now my mother doesn't just prepare. I prepared it. Which even that that potty way they cook. Ah, potty? And you came for it? I want to go for energy with that very guy. You know, then, Jabba, you don't talk like that. No, talk like that. You don't talk like that. Oh, no, what's happening now? Go tell her, deal with her. Good. 
go inside and deal with her, as in. I'm mean, going inside and go and beat her up now. I always like. like that one go land me for trouble now. Who be your other one, sir? My sir. Go do it, I ask you if you still need your job. No worry. I, I, in fact, she's dead. Go inside there to, to deal with that. Yes, sir. As you instructed, I entered the America, I deal with that. I nearly dealt with that, but along the line, she now dealt with you with food. Eh? It was sorry, sir. Ah, it was. We had an accident. I can see you haven't care and respect for me again. I can now see you. I'll you. I'm sorry, sir. Now. No, no need for me shouting. Well, I'm going to come back. If you bring your side, but I won't end this. Go leave here. No, please, I don't want to leave now. I've never got into that trap. I beg you. It's three four. I've got to thank you now, but I won't call my own chef on your side. Now I didn't even leave you. Your pack, huh? Don't do this to me now. No, I'm going to tell you what to do. I'm going to hire five. No, first. Well, I want to beat first in what they feed me. I'm going to talk to the top. Say, okay. Sure. Sorry, no, sir. Small of that, small of that. This do not come back. This don't come back. How come? Don't come back. 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 Job now, not you say you don't find me. I'll go do that thing. I know she say you don't know me. I know they do anything. You just see me so I the vest for you. I the vest for you seriously because because I get this job through you. Make you know come they respect me again. Like they will be mates. They talk to me anyhow. So as you see me so no while you don't fuck me. You don't suck me. Month and give me my money. Come on here. As go with the Go for the gate. Now as you waiting, the baby you are fired. You are fired. No worry. I think that was the. Maybe I'll go go open the gates. No worry, balance. I'm fired. Yes, month end. Pay me, make I go. Me say I don't time for this. So now you be the mother one of the top. 
Why you with madam? Eh? Mary Ann. Where the bed wet? Why you with madam? Hey, how? How you think manipulate this people? Bring your face down. They don't know you. Mary Ann. I don't believe you get to walk out. You put anything like my mind up there. You know what they say to you in the bed wet? You're not dead there. You, madam, here. Um, for, for now, she, she, she's calm, okay? I mean, the injuries were not that much, so okay. she's stable. Thank God about oh, that. Thank God. Thank God. So how is your wife? Is she here now? <laughs> of course, she's downstairs. Hey. I actually came up to make sure that um, the room is set before bringing her upstairs. Ah, it's set. We're good to go. <laughs> All right. I can always count on you. Can you go? I think it's time I start deducting your salary each time you call me, sir. Uh, that way you'll be mindful. Sorry, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Thank Can you. I go see her? Of course, let's oh, go. Oh. <laughs> Have a new wife. <laughs> I'm fine. I'm I'm just tired. Are I'm, you sure? Yes, I need to rest. All right, I understand. Okay, I mean, after all we've been through today, so I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry about the stress. Hmm? Okay, fine. <laughs> <laughs> um, they, yeah, it's my uh, my friend, but my dear friend, my auntie, and my wonderful. <laughs> and it's wonderful because the juice is wonderful. Okay, and uh, Edna. Yeah, it's uh, my beloved wife. I mean, the woman that drives me crazy. <laughs> wow! She's gorgeous. She's beautiful. Welcome, ma'am. <laughs> ma'am? Oh, please. Don't call me ma'am, okay? You can call me Mary Ann. My name is Mary Ann. Oh, welcome, Mary Ann, ma'am. She's the other part. <laughs> she keeps telling you. Okay, this you're addressing me as uh, sir, and now you're addressing her as ma'am. Come on. It's too fake and awkward. Okay, considering the the age gap. <laughs> Please. You are my boss for life, and you brought another boss woman. I'm loyal forever, ma'am. I'm sad. <laughs> All right, ma'am. I'm boss woman. <laughs> hey, no, please, stop making us laugh. Um, how about take it inside? Oh, welcome, ma'am. Thank you. You know that you're supposed to be washing the clothes after the bathroom? I will do that later, ma'am. But for now, I'll, I'll just hold it down. Okay, go, 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 go. I'm not going to laugh again. I told you to wash that car. You see that car? I go wash them two times. But for now, I'm not laughing. I want them to laugh. Hey, hey, hey. One dash shall never end. Up. This house is getting more expensive. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. You see that's your dry pranks and jokes. I am not in the mood for it. Excuse me, boy. Oh, I didn't think I'm out of life and death. They call me boy. Now nah, get mad. He's laughing on for two levels. So I can make my position. Ah, 
Yes. Do I look like a psychiatrist to you? Please don't distract me. You can say I'm very busy. I can, I can stay on your own, stay on your lane. You are not be tagging me. You are seriously beautiful. I slap you. You see all the action all your fans you've been giving me. I will tell her. Okay, I will stop you. You are not pulling your fans. Don't make me go all through your body, idiot. Do I blame you? I'm not Pama. Give you one half one. He's laughing now uncontrollably. How is that my problem? You may be wanting to carry on controllably. Ewu. Hello, one, two, three. Sir, <laughs> <laughs> you're drinking juice today because today is a special day. Thank you very much, my health coach. <laughs> <laughs> you doesn't allow me to drink, drink juice. It's water, water, water. Are you serious? But that's nice. <laughs> I made this for you, ma'am. Oh, really? Yeah. I know you will like it, ma'am. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Thank mm -hmm. you. Welcome, ma'am. <laughs> and said, no, please, can you stop this? My name is Mary Ann. Just call me Mary Ann. Stop this ma'am thing. I don't like it. Okay. okay. Sorry, ma'am. <laughs> Only person is complaining. My dear, that's what I've been passing through in this house. Every day, sa, 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 sa. In fact, I've, I, I've told her that uh, I'll be deducting her salary each time she calls me, sir. Or you, ma'am. Better. Mm. Supported. That way, she'll be mindful of it. <laughs> Sorry, sir, I will change, sir. But you are my Oga. Oga is, sir. Oga madobo, sir. Fred. Okay, Fred, sir. Get her. Oh, jeez. <laughs> uh, enjoy your meal. Let me take care of the kitchen. Okay. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. welcome, ma'am. She seems to be a nice person. Mm. She's more than a cook. And she... She's a wonderful person, a wonderful soul, I must say. She's a great confident, I mean, someone I confide in in this house. She has given me so many advice that has helped me in my business. She's one good person, I mean, one good soul that I know. Mm. She seems to be a nice person. Mm. And I like her. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, honey. You'll get to know more about her soon. Oh, um, yeah. I'm lucky to have her in this house. All right. <laughs> Let's eat. Um, but what are you trying to do? Let's pray first. Okay? I was waiting to know if you're going to say that. Oh, pretty. <laughs> All right, let's pray. Thank you, Lord, for this food. Mm. Thank you for my new home. Amen. Thank you for my husband. Amen. Thank you for Auntie Edna. Amen. Bless this food in Amen. Jesus' name. Amen. Were you closing your eyes? Of course I am. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, cheers to our new home, your new family. Yes. Cheers. Mm. And to Auntie Edna for this wonderful meal. Okay. Okay. I told you she did Disgrace to me, I will sack you. Take a bag and go. I'm done with you. I'll pay you for the days you have won. Believe me. You know, say if not before, I'm gonna shake the break you. Please don't change it. Levels don't change. Um, After what I saw in this house today, I'll be seeing you now. I don't understand what you see. You don't understand that because foods don't block everywhere for everybody. What I try to let you know, say. 
Not be before why they beg you make you know. And the next time where you go touch my bag, eh? Is this your ear? I go come out and share a minute to me and you go chop up. Yeah, you are who be your boss. As a matter of fact, now I get for a party for you. Who be your guy for you? Let me know. Who be your guy? Where am I going to get? Carry this bag. Carry him, carry him, carry him. Must take him. Carry him, go back. Carry him, go back. Don't lose your level, don't you? Carry him, go back. Edna, thank you so much. The food was something else. Sweet. Thank you. I appreciate it. You're welcome, man. <laughs> but you don't need to thank me. I only did my job. Yes, I know you did your job. Oh, you're such a humble person. Thank you, man. You're such a sweet soul. I think I have to learn from that. Learn from you. And then I would like you to teach me how to put to my husband's satisfaction. I believe you've stayed here long. And you know what he likes and what he doesn't. Don't worry, I will gladly teach you everything you need to know. His likes, his stuff, his kind of food, how he wants it. I'll teach you. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Um, Auntie Edna, there's a young man I saw at the gate. I don't know. How long has he been working here? It's not quite long he's been working here. I will tell you, he's only one month ago. I hope he has not disrespected me. Oh, no, no, not at all. You, you know, I'm, I'm just new to the house, the family, so I, I want to know everybody. But that's it. All the same, thank you very much for it. You're welcome. Yeah. All right. I am not happy at all. What happened? Is it not the gate man? This, 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 this man. Is it not that man? The gate man? Yes. Hey, that reminds me. Edna complained about you to me in this house. She complained how you've been insulting her. Oh, I don't be Edna, I take on you. Will you shut up? I'm talking to you. Do you want to still continue working here as a houseboy? No, sir, I will not get you to become bank manager next year. But for now, I might become my might be houseboy first. And be very, very careful. Akrika, be very, very careful. This should be the first and last time I'll hear any complaint about you in this house. You hear me? Are you stupid? I'm talking to you, you're doing me like this. I said, shut up! The next time I hear any nonsense complaint about you, you see yourself outside. You hear me? I'm I'll get out. What are all I'm so sorry, honey. Okay? I'm sorry for keeping you waiting. Alright, I was with uh, Edna. Really? That's yeah. okay. That's fine. Uh, What's this awful smell? An oh, awful smell. You, you can't perceive it. No. Oh, no. I can't perceive anything. Oh. I, I, this is serious. This is this is. Oh, I, I can't. I. It's smelling. Nothing is smelling. Nothing. Are you sure you can't perceive anything? No. <laughs> well, I guess it's my senior's illness. I'll get it treated, okay? Yes. Right. You have to. <laughs> <laughs> Ouch. Uh, what, what is it? Uh, 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 what, what is it? My head. I'm having this serious headache. Oh. Alright, come here. I understand, okay? Mm. I guess it's the um, stress. From the long journey. Okay. Yeah. Okay, you know what? Let me just quickly get you no, some. No, 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 no. Don't worry. I just need some rest. That's Are you it. sure? Yes, I'm fine. I'm okay. I'll be fine. You're Come sure, honey? On. I'm very All sure. right. <coughs> <laughs> it's okay. Um, in that case, then uh, I'll let you have some rest. 
I was thinking before the rest, uh, maybe we could just, uh, you know. I'm, 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 I'm a baby, not today. I'm very tired. Mm -hmm. Please, please, not today, okay? Are you sure this one picked itself? No, 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 no. Are you sure? Yes, I'm very sure. <laughs> Alright. You can have a rest now. Okay? Thank you. Why did you go to one? Why are you changed already? Uh, um, actually, I, I I perceived the same smell. You know, you were complaining about one funny smell last night. Yeah. So when I woke up, I perceived the same smell. So I looked around, I checked everywhere, and I saw your dirty clothes. So I decided to go wash them. What? You did? You did what? How could you? I mean, it's too early. How could you go out to wash by this time? Look, honey, I didn't bring you to my house to have you do the laundry stuff, okay? To have you wash clothes. I didn't. Alright? I have the laundry man who will take care of that. I mean, that's their job. Um, I'm sorry, I, actually, I wasn't the one that washed the clothes. I gave it to mm -hmm. the new guest man. Dubem? Wash. Ah, honey, see, um, I'm going to give you the contact of my laundry person, okay? As soon as you see or feel there's anything dirty around the house that you're not comfortable with, please reach out to them immediately. You'll come and get it done. I'm not too big, okay? Well, why are you. Uh you probably should do the laundry now. What's he doing in this house? Just at the gate, doing nothing. He should do the laundry. He should be the one washing clothes and everything in this house. Well, you're right. Okay, I mean, I cannot just um, sit there doing nothing. Yeah. Right, but you have to give him yourself. Okay? I insist. It has to be every other material, but not your personal things. Please, the beam should never wash your personal clothes. Fine. I won't give the beam my personal clothes. Alright. So what is my darling going to have for breakfast? Mm -hmm. <laughs> what? Tell me. What do you want? Mm -hmm. Come. Okay. Mm -hmm. Listen, you don't want to say okay. <laughs> anything, okay, anything. I mean, anything my, my queen prepares. Okay. I'll give you some things too. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, I'm off. Off to? Catch you in the car. So? To show you what my magic fingers can do. Uh -huh. Mm hmm. Uh, come, <laughs> here. come here. I should come? Come here. First. Not the kitchen. Not the kitchen. Yeah, no. first. <laughs> Come, come here before the time, okay? Oh, oh, oh. 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 Oh, they fear you so. See what I'm not going to fall in Tanya. Spending chop money. One good thing about big man has to say no matter the amount of trouble, you're going to feel well first. Oh, please, actually, the patient is your sis. Have you seen the doctor? Yes, you can see Oh, okay. Nurse, mm -hmm. let me see the file from the patient. Okay. Okay. Ah, yeah, doctor. So please, I'll put the high shape. Um, our blood pressure spiked due to some complications. No, calm down, calm down. We almost lost that. Oh, thank you. 
you were able to have a talk. Ah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much, Doctor. I am grateful. Thank you. Huh. What a nice thing about you, are, Doctor. Thank you so much. Yeah. Um, okay. Like I said before, do anything. Okay, anything you can do whatsoever within your power to make sure that nothing happens to her. Okay. Um, so, sorry, Doctor, I have to take this call. My wife, she, she has been so worried as well. No problem. Hello, honey. Yes, yes, I, I am I'm with the doctor right now. Yes, he said um, everything is under control right now. I mean, she's stable. No, 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 honey. Look, you don't have to call. Okay, don't worry. When I. When I come back, I will, I will brief you properly. Okay? Alright, I, I love you. Okay? Bye. I'm so sorry about that, Doctor. Oh, it's fine. So, like I was saying, okay, please, do anything, okay? Anything you can do to make sure that nothing happens to that little girl. Okay, as for the bills, please, I will cover the bills. I mean, money will not be a problem. Okay? I understand you, please. okay? Uh, we will do our best. Alright? We care. But God cures. Okay? Thank you. Can I see you in my office? Of course, of course. Thank you so much, Doctor. Thank you. Ah, Jesus. I saw you having a conversation with Oh, ah, that reminds me. I, I wanted to ask you a question. Yes. Please, do you have any idea if Dubem smokes? Because that was exactly what Akeka came to tell me. Yeah. I don't have any idea. I have never seen Dubem smoke. Ever since he came to this house. I don't know. I've never seen him smoke. Is that what he told you? Yes. Stop talking to that boy. That boy you see is very mischievous and very manipulative. Stop talking to him. Huh? Before he will call up to you. Now I know better. But please, um, sorry to ask again. I would like to know how did he come to this place? How did he move here, moving the empty? You know. His father was a gardener to my master's late father. So when he passed, my master is very kind. He decided to help that little thing you see. That is why you see him moving around here. Trying to give false information here and there. No matter how little you see him there, he passed too much roundish. Don't mind whatever he says. Don't trust whatever he says because he's passing some false information that is misleading you. Stay away from him. I'm repeating myself for emphasis. Oh, stay away from him. Okay. Thank you for letting me know. I'll stay away. <laughs> hey, these oranges, are they okay or should I bring more? Mm -hmm. I'm okay with this one. I'm very okay. You take it more so that when you go to the pilot, you just pass. Yeah. <laughs> so, how are you feeling now? Who are you? Um, I, uh, I am um, Mr. Fred, the man that brought you here. Where is this place? I, I don't understand what is going on here. Um, <clears throat> this is a hospital. Okay, you were involved in a, in a car accident. Car accident? H how? Hey, hey, calm down, okay, please. Um, do you have anyone I can call? In your parents or any of your relatives that just reach over the phone? Mm -mm. I uh, I don't have a relative. I'm alone. Yes. What? You don't have anyone. So what? What are you doing? What are you doing on the road? In the city, and you don't have anyone. You don't have any parent, no guardian, nobody to reach on. How? It's it's just that I I don't want to go back to that place. 
Please, sir. I don't want to go back to that place. I prefer to stay in the village. Please. Why? I, I hope all is well. E yeah, yes. No, no, yes. Yes, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. Are, are you okay? Yes. Mm -mm, no. Um, Please. What, what is the problem? Can you tell me? You prefer to go back to the village? Yes. Sir, please, I, I don't want to go back to them. Please, I beg of you. Uh, okay, I I will see what I can do. Okay, but first, you need to recover fully. Okay, after that, um, we can take it off from there. Okay. Thank you, sir. God bless you. You're welcome. So, do you care for anything? Take this money, go buy me pepper down the road. Those red big big ones. I think I'm talking to you. Agarika! Look at this boy. Are you mad? No. I'm not in the mood now. Go and buy your thing. Ah. Okay. I should go and buy my thing. If you don't go and buy this pepper, rest assured there will be consequences. I really mean. Okay, no problem. I will go and buy and cook the food. The rest will be his day. Wait, yeah. Give me money, darling. I'll go buy some. I'll go to the hungry now. I'll do this thing. If mm -hmm. not, don't force me to do it. I'm going to hire to be reported for that. That I'm going to go. Not to come out. So will food not come out? That's where we go. So will you die of hunger? But why to play? You know, this is I come this out. They chop my food. Don't play me 17. One. So today, I have food and I chop. Yeah. I never want to say what you talk. My, my good side come out first. What did I talk to say? I have food and I chop. What you love? It's gone. Not the only use I be chop first with you. I need another hand. Why are you going to use the chop now? You don't You don't want place now. I can't use that food. Don't use the chop my food, you see? That's 17 How am I supposed to know the gate man ate his food? He was the person that brought the gate man into the house. Whatever that went wrong between them, I don't know because it's not like I'm fine. You see? See how so foolish our reasonable is now. You watch your mouth, young man. That is fucked. Mama, your mate. I'm going to 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 if you keep insulting me, when the young insult the old, they will never be old. Um, enough. Enough, both of you. Okay, and, and said, now nah, enough. Enough. Give me your pomme a box. Enough. Please, just stop. And you, what's that your name again? Tell her your name on a call. Say, you, you be me, I be you. I'm saying. Mama, I my name is who can who answers that kind of name? Obro Nyawa. Akeka. It seems you're very troublesome, right? Me? No! I'm not fighting for my right. Which right? Freedom fighter, which right? You want to eat everybody's food? Um, listen, listen, mm. both of you. Akeka, no. if you are fighting for your right, I understand. Mm -hmm. If you're talking about the food issue, I understand. And said, 
please. Africa deserves a plate of food in this house. For crying out loud, he is a worker here. He's living with us in this house. Oh! Yeah! yeah. Oh! Um, a what? Wait. Come and, come and kill me. I take the food. Shut up and let me finish. That's how you insult me every day. Auntie Edna, please. When you cook, give Akrika his food. Don't give it to someone else. Leave her like this, I'll be I don't have a bag, I don't look fish. Have you seen the way this boy insults me? Have you seen the way this boy, this boy insults me? Auntie Edna, Auntie Edna. This boy. Auntie Edna, please just leave him. Leave him, please. Oh, can you shut up before I'll beat you? You talk too much. This is how that you beat. You talk too much. This is an elderly woman. Uh -uh, why are you talking to her like that? I will Jack. not tolerate this rubbish in this house. I will not. I think I better watch yourself. I will not tolerate it. Go on. Go on, Idiot. Um, I'll tell you, even if it's noodles for him to eat. You ah. for who? Give you that for who will make the noodles for him? This one, I will make noodles for this one. If you want to go and make noodles, make it for yourself. You think I don't know how to make noodles? You think I don't know how to make noodles? I don't know how to make noodles. Have you heard him? I heard him. What he's stupid. Have you heard him? Have you heard this idiot? You want to box me? Come here. I will not make anything, man. Man, I will not make anything. Let him come and make it himself. You don't because you're here. I'm not. I'm not. You see, she just walk out on her madam now. It's not for you now. Hang up, don't wear. Get out. Okay, go. I'm hungry. Like seriously? This boy is something else. He's troublesome. He's very troublesome. Ah. And, and said now, please, you have to make a letter for me. She says she's having issues with the people she's living with, and uh, she wished to return to her parents in the village. Oh. I can, I can imagine what she's passing through in the hands of the people she's living with. For her to have said all this to you. Honey, you, you needed to have seen the fear. I mean, the fear in her eyes when she was telling me all that. She even wept while pleading with me not to take her back. Really? For that poor girl. Honey, what do you think? What are we going to do? Um, I was thinking, you know, maybe I should just grant her a wish of taking her back to her parents in the village. But first, I need to let her have a full recovery. I mean, she needs to recover first. Okay. So, uh, how long is she expected to stay at the hospital? Um, not too long, according to the doctor. She'll be seeing an orthopedic uh, doctor and a psychiatrist by next week. So, after that, I, I believe she'll be discharged. Okay. Okay. Um, but, honey, I was, um, I was thinking, okay, I mean, why she's going through this um, healing process? If she could come and stay with us, you know, I mean, give her proper care and all that. I don't know how you're going to react about it, so. Ah, uh, come on, sweetheart. I have no problem with that. Yes, it's, it's fine. He's just an innocent girl. Um. It's fine. She can come and stay with us here. Get healed first before going to her people. Um. I'm going to take good care of her. I promise. Thank you so much, honey. Thank you. I'm, I'm always proud of you. You know that. <laughs> <laughs> and you too. 
Okay. Time to go and freshen up, okay? And, uh, now you have to take me I'll upstairs. beat you. No, Don't you have start. To Don't even start. <laughs> You're dressed. Um, yes, I am. Oh, you look good. <laughs> Thank you. <Yeah. laughs> All right, breakfast is set. So fast? Yes, trust me. All right, I'm almost done, okay? Just a minute. Okay. Honey. What? That awful smell is still there. Um, um, the smell? Mm. Come on, honey. Probably it's the water that splashed on the bed last night. No. Oh, okay. Um, in that case, uh, please ask um, Akrita. Okay, I mean the gate man. Okay, to I mean the house boy. Let him take out the the foam and in fact take out everything and some dry it. Oh, okay, please. Of course, yeah, this, I. The smell is awful. I'll do that. Sound, All right. Um, Hannah. Yeah. Yeah. We'll be visiting um, Ihoma tomorrow. Ihoma, who is Ihoma? Honey? Yes. The plantain seller girl. Oh, 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 oh. Come on, you've forgotten already. No, 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 no. Oh, poor girl. Honey, please, um, we have to visit her tomorrow for filling the case. Very, very important. Yes. Okay? We have to visit her. Poor girl is a terrible caregiver. I wonder when parents will start treating children that are not biologically theirs now. This is not fair. Honey, you can say that again. I mean, some of these so-called parents and these caregivers, they can be so annoying. I mean, so, so annoying sometimes. Very. You know what? I, I will make sure that I definitely hand her over to her parents myself as soon as she's ready to leave. Really? Okay? Yes. <laughs> okay, no problem. The um, the church wedding is just by the corner. I hope you will not be missing. No, Evan. You don't have to say that. I'm there sure? with you. <laughs> <laughs> because that day, <laughs> Mark, you will be championing all the preparations. So you have me. Okay. You have me. All right, no problem. <laughs> um, so tell me, how is she? Beautiful or. <laughs> Wait. No, 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 no. With this smile on your face, mm. I think I already know what the answer is. <laughs> <laughs> you were not disappointed, I guess. Well, no, <laughs> no, 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 no. I was, you know, at first I was, um, I was being very skeptical. You know, I was go traveling to the village. Of course, I've not seen her before. Yeah. But trust me, bro. When I got to the village, guy, now I truly know that my mother loves me. Wow. You know why she has been saying, "I love you, son. I love you, son." I, I was like, okay, but now. Not just that she loves me, guy. My mom has eyes for spiritual things. Yeah, I mean, my mom can see beyond the beauty. Are you serious? Mark, you need to see yeah. my wife. I mean, she's not just beautiful. She's indeed everything every responsible man would ask for. But I told you. <laughs> I told you. You know, I think I will come and meet your mother to help me look for a girl. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Okay, okay. okay. <laughs> Oh my god, mm -hmm. I'm so happy for you, man. Thank and then you. one more thing. Um, okay. I'll be coming to your house this weekend to behold this beauty you described to me, if it's okay with you. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Mark, of course. You know, my house is always open for you. Okay. You know what? Um, when I get home, I will tell my wife that um, my stubborn friend is coming over this weekend so we can uh, prepare for you. <laughs> wow, <laughs> see my man, <laughs> you are now using um, we uh, instead of I. Uh, what are you expecting? <laughs> <man. laughs> I, I said man. I said <laughs> Perfect, Andy. <laughs> 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 That's good on you. Thank you. Thank you. That's good on you. Thank you very much. Um, so tell me, how is her English? Hope she didn't behave awkward mm -hmm. like a village girl that she is. Nah, not at all. I mean, far from that. Moreover, she's not a village girl. No, she's not. She has never been a village girl. You know, she told me that um, she has lived all her life in Abuja with her parents. Yeah, I mean, stayed there together until things fell apart. You know, I mean, things became rough for the father. So, 
get relocated back to the village. So it's not as if she's a village girl. Besides, Mark, you know me very well now. You know me. I can't settle down for a village girl. Where would I start from? I said, no, no, no. Where, where would I start from? Teaching her English, taking her around, showing. That's what I'm I know fit. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. I can't. That's what I'm asking. <laughs> so, my friend, I'm so happy for you. So, cheers. All right. Cheers to new life mm -hmm. and a new beginning. Mm -hmm. Congratulations, Marie. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much. Why am I putting on this clothes? This is not what I wore today. Mm -hmm. Honey, I'm talking to you. Why, why, why the change of clothes? This is certainly not what I wore to bed. What happened? I don't, I don't understand. I don't understand. This was the clothes you wore now. If you don't make me look stupid, okay? Hmm? I know what I wore to bed last night, and this is certainly not it. I mean, this is not what I wore to bed last night. How come? Who changed my clothes? This was the clothes you wore now. Hmm? This was the same clothes you wore last night. Maybe. Are you sure you didn't take the whiskey I saw on the dining table last night? Whiskey? Mm. Whiskey. Babe, you know I don't do whiskey. Mm. Baby, please, I, I need to sleep. Oh, just let me be. I need to sleep, okay? Come on, let's sleep. Let's All right, um, babe, babe. Hmm. Oh, let me sleep now. What is this? I please. don't like this. Babe, uh, please listen. Okay, um, my friend Mark is visiting this weekend. Hmm. Mark. Yeah. I know Mark. He's visiting. Okay. Babe, mm -hmm. he said he's visiting this weekend and the weekend is tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Okay? Mark is a friend, I mean, he's more like a brother to me. He has been supporting me all this while. Please, I... I need you to prepare something very special for him. Mm -hmm. You know that would be a problem. I can do that. So... What do you want me to prepare? What's this favorite meal? What do you want me to mm. prepare? Just do anything, anything nice and special. Okay. Okay. I did. So can I sleep now? Come, let's, let's sleep. Come, come to bed. Come to bed. Alright, go to bed. Thank you. Thank you. I'll sleep to you. Sleep. Sleep. Hold me. Hold me. Hold me. Mm -hmm. Okay, I love you. Mm -hmm. Watch blue film, you do small for that thing. No, they watch porn. If you see what you they talk as you they sleep, eh? You go go confession. Avoid blue film. Who could they call you? Huh? I'm sorry. You scared me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I did. Are, are you okay? I mean, I'm sorry I started you, but then. What is it? What is wrong with you? I'm okay. I'm, I'm fine. Just that I, I miss my people. I miss my mom. Come here. 
Come. It's okay. I understand. Come on. I mean, first year in your husband's house is usually like this. Okay? New environment, new home, new everybody, new faces. So, I expected this from you. Okay? My sister did the same thing when she got married. I mean, she only adjusted with time. So, I expect you to do the same thing. Okay? It's all right. Especially when um, this beautiful, sexy, gorgeous lady here starts producing baby. I mean, starts having beautiful children. <laughs> Come here. I can't wait. Mm -hmm. I can't wait to have my kids. Mm -hmm. At least they'll stay in here with me huh. when you leave me for work. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now someone's trying to set me up. It's alright. No, it's okay. no. <laughs> alright, honey. Um, my friend Mark is coming today. Oh yes. Mm -hmm. I remember. I hope you didn't forget. Mm -mm. Alright. <laughs> so I want to quickly rush out to get some drinks. I want you to prepare something very, very, very special for him. But I trust you. You know, like your magic fingers. I'm already on it. Mm -hmm. In fact, Edna. Is on it. Ah. I'll join her soon. Please, <laughs> very important. Okay, I need to supervise it. I right. will. Alright, I trust you. Be quick. Yeah. I don't mm -hmm. want to miss it too much. Mm, I see you soon. <laughs> I love you, honey. Love you too. Wow. Welcome to my home. Honey. Wow. Hey. What's happening? Fred, I'm home. I have a massive work. Wow. Yes. 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 You're welcome, darling. Thank you, honey. Um, what happened? I mean, I'm um, hanging at the gate and no one is opening the gate for me. I didn't even see the gate. And again, I observed that uh, one of my cars is not there. Why? And actually, I, I sent Duben to go buy for, for the generator. You, you, you sent the bin to go buy fuel for the generator? Yes. Well, come on, but I use inverter at home. So what's the fuel for? Oh, 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 oh. Yes, yes. Forgive me. Seriously, I forgot. And even the fool you sent to buy the fuel knows very well that I use inverter in my house. So why? What, what, I mean, come on. I'm sorry. I, I forgot. My bad. My bad. Seriously. It's okay. Anyway, I'm sorry. sorry for keeping you standing, okay? Uh, my friend, Mark. The one I've been telling you about. And uh, Mike. Your wife. My pretty wife. <laughs> Not my wife, my pretty wife. Oh. <laughs> you look so beautiful. Mm. Just as it's described. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> and you appear gentle. Oh, really? Like you told me. <laughs> <laughs> I lied, honey. Mm, that's a blatant lie. You lie. Excuse you. This young man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Go follow the way. Um, Mark, you are welcome to our house. Mm. Make yourself comfortable. Yeah, I taste sure. the food. All right, honey, please. Sure. I'm starting already. Okay. Okay. Mm. What do you want to say, my friend? Uh, I like this one. <laughs> Congratulations <laughs> once again. Thank you, Okem. Okay. <laughs> you made a nice choice. What? Well, yeah. Just you don't have a bad place here. I like your house. Enough, <laughs> place, you know? enough. I mean, you are not doing badly for yourself. So, <laughs> you know what? Fred, Fred. I just can't wait for you to, to test the other side of me. My wife's food. She can cook. She's a wonderful cook. So what am I waiting for? <laughs> <laughs> you go mad. <laughs> I'm here. Honey, please hurry up, okay? Please. Wow. Alright. Let me make this now. Let me check off. How's my chest now? Just a minute, I'm coming. Alright. Uh, Where did you go? Eh? You told me you're going to be back before my husband returns. Mary Ann, ask me what you have first. O okay, fine. What happened? Good. You know that T junction where they refer the name? Which T junction? That T junction where they want the uh, uh, thing for that turn about. Uh, I know, I know. As I they negotiate the right, I don't want it. I in this keke. This keke from nowhere. 
Ani, na small damage. Small, small damage. You jam me now. Ten goes zero kilo. You crash the car. No problem. Um, you have to go. You have to go and buy food. Because, no, what do you, what do you expect me to tell my husband? What do you want to tell my husband? Eh? What do you tell him? What do you tell husband now? I told him that I sent you to go and buy food. How you talk like that now? You now, nah, eh, do like they had you. Why small like he's your husband now? You know what to tell him. How do you tell him I go buy food? Invite him to this house now. I should lie small lie. Lie small lie. I should lie small lie. Like small lie. Like Don't you know if I lie small lie, I will need another lie to cover up the lies. How much is lie? Keep lying now. I don't understand you at all. I don't understand you. Just go and get some. You, you went and passed the car. Just no, no car for you at all. Because he's not going to allow me to drive this car again. Will you let that happen? You know they allow him to do that one now. By the wife, my lies small lie. Press small button. Everywhere will good. Last last, I gotta go walk in car. Okay, go work in car. Eh, you have no problem. The only thing you have to do now is for you to take this cake and go and buy it for. That is it. You distress me. You, de you, de you, de you distress me. Stand up, Biko. Stress you. Hey, no. Hey. Go now. Okay, carry I, I, where do you think you're going? I won't carry the other car now. Are you okay? You won't carry which car? You've bashed this one, you want to carry another one. What is the what is the essence of having two cars? If you bash one, you carry the other one. Jubem, please take a car and go, go and buy the four. Ah, you won't make big boy like me use keke go buy four. Oh really? You're a big boy. You didn't negotiate it when you jumped the keke. Abi, go Biko. See, you're stressing me. Make I use car go buy this thing. Jubem, please go now. You you know my husband has visitor inside. Don't cause trouble for me. I think that's why I get this at all. I... I just discovered that... Um, the back bone of one of my cars was damaged. I mean, I asked the gate man and said it was evil damage when you drove out. How? Babe, uh, actually, I... What? I... Do you know how to drive? Yes, somehow. I, I know how to drive. I used to drive my father's car back then. I, I thought I have perfected the driving skill. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I was... I was wrong. I was scared of telling you. I'm sorry. It's okay. It's alright. Um, I will have it fixed by tomorrow. Okay? Thank I have also made I mean, I've completed all necessary plans in enrolling you to your driving school by next week. Okay? Especially now that this has happened, you need to perfect your driving skill. You don't need to assume. Okay? You need to perfect, I mean, you need to learn properly. Okay? Can you? Oh, of course, I, I will. <laughs> you know, I can't wait to, to see my beautiful wife. Driving out with any of my cars anytime she likes. <laughs> <laughs> and I can't wait to start driving you to office uh, everywhere. Mark will see Shaggy. I told you 100k. But this is 90,000 man. Uh, many thank you. Um, Dibir, I'll sort the remaining 10,000 naira by next week. Next week? Yes. Next week? Yes. Next week? Next week, next week I Don't can't. Don't fail. No fail. This is your secret, where I take it for you. It's the heavy. It's the heavy me inside my body. It's not easy to carry. I am a secret box. So for that reason, you will be servicing me every now and then. Do you understand? Yes, I will service you. Okay. Where are you going now? Hold on, don't be in a hurry to go. I decide where you will go. Also the key there. The other parts are there. The feet don't dry. So as you walk up, carry them going inside. Okay. Where are you going now? You can go now. Okay. Come back here, madam. Make you no family next to me. 
else I will please your mom. The baby celebrity gets mad. Ibu The baby celebrity get man. I mean, Ibu kwa mwa bia. Spending chop money. Onye jeko ni Ibu bakaria. Akuna taka si nomzo. Ote wa ni si Ibu bakaria. Oh my god, the celebrity get man. don't have respect. But must you also behave in a very stupid manner like you're doing now? I asked because I did not see anybody at the gate and you're being stupid. Shall I let you know she? Shall you see um on that big jeep? Shall you see have to wait here? Badge into my room like that. Uh, uh, Ma, I'm sorry. What I'm about to tell you requires your urgent attention. And what is it? Uh, I just came back and discovered that uh, Oga's uh, big jeep is missing. And when I made the inquiry, they said uh, the gate man went out with it. Hey! Be careful like that. Just took it out. Is that all? Yes, that is all. Well, I sent him on an errand with the vehicle. But, mm. madam, I am what? I don't get it until now. Are you trying to question my actions? No, ma. Just that, you know, young people of these days, before you go and buy the car, you also have any value because you didn't buy the car. You have any value attached to the car? I've heard you. But next time, don't budge into my room like that. Okay, ma. I'm sorry, ma. Go. The Dubim you're talking about is your gate man, right? So? You trusted him, that's why you employed him, right? So? Who's talking about trust here? Honey, I am not talking about trust. Of course I trust him, that's why I employed him. But come on. I employed him as a gate man, not as a driver. Then get me a driver. Get me a driver that will be driving me around. Besides, I've been meaning to ask Dubim to take me on an extra driving lessons. Whenever I return from driving school. Yes, it can help me to learn fast. How can you ask Dubim to take you on an extra driving lessons? How? I don't even know, know his um, driving capability. Dubim, we are talking about knows how to drive. He has been the one driving your cars. And never for once he has scratched it. I've been sending him errands with your cars. Alright. I understand. I do. Okay, fine. If you don't want me to send him again, if you don't want him to drive your cars, no problem. I'm not going to ask him to drive it or send him anywhere. It's okay, honey. It's alright. 
I mean, enough of this um, Dubé, Mkaa, and everything. Enough of it. I mean, I've touched it long enough. So, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. look, um, you can send him to anywhere, okay? As long as you're happy with it. I mean, as long as you're okay. All right? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm back home, so I need all the time I can get you with my woman. You always needing all the time. Mm -hmm. Stop it. Mm -hmm. Tell me, how was your day? Ah, uh, well... I was filled with drops here and there. I know. Okay. I'm here but to I missed you. you. I'm here to take care of you, don't worry. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. You missed me? I missed you. I missed it too. <laughs> Wait, why didn't they bring this to finish? I don't understand. What did you say in Why you know this have me for breakable plates? Why they put me up for my rubber? I be dog. I saw Ghana. Do you know I saw you? I stepped out to buy something and I saw you cruising that car. A water again. That's why you're asking for breakable plates. Your problem is old age. Mm. But I have a solution. Go to the hospital. Tell them to give you medicated eyeglass. So that you're going to see now because I don't know who you see. Say you see me for that car. Secondly, if you must serve me, use breakable plates. Else, stop serving me. Stop serving me, I will not stop. Carry you to break a plate or nothing. I see you and your husband. I be I saw you and your husband. I don't know. But I see two of them. My body teller they tell me say na me on they talk about. Me? No, your shadow. No, I wasn't talking about you. Mary Ann, listen no. If your husband sack me, I go catch to you. I will expose you. I go expose you, Oto Oto. There is no way he can sack you. <laughs> Why would I want you sacked? Eh? I keep your secret, oh. Keep my own, no. Oh. Make them. If I lose this job, I, you go even appear for paper. Internet, no. they learn. Mm, I go even do. I go. You see, I go catch to you. Baby, stop all these things now. Why are you threatening me? Stop all these things you're doing. Stop it! I'm trying to. I'm trying. I'm not threatening you. I'm just telling you. Madam. But you, you have to do something for me. You have to limit the way you go around with my husband's car, even carrying your friends inside. Limit it. The day he's going to catch you, I'll not guarantee you your safety. I'll not guarantee your safety. Stop it. No problem. I will, I will work on that. Meanwhile, I will be. I will need like one million naira this weekend. One million what? Naira, no be dollar. One million naira. To me, where do you expect me to get that kind of money from? With your wine me. Is your husband not a multi-millionaire? Hey! Why is the woman in you? Press one or two buttons, you know, he, he, he soft, soft spot now. Touch him and collect one million naira for me. We get doings by weekend. One million naira is too much, please. It's too much. I cannot do it too. Consider the secret I'm coding and I'm harboring for you. The secret is heavy. And each time I'm broke, my body will be telling me, cast her, cast her, say the truth, and the truth shall set you free. So be careful. You cannot do this to me. You cannot do this to me. This this threat, you have to stop it. You cannot do this to me, Dubim. Just... Where will I get home in the night from? I love a word to give up and up to him. Go, brother. Bring that one. Make a thing. Is it? Is it this morning? You can always smell it, but okay. you can never touch it. We, we, we had an agreement now. Now that agreement will kill you there. Nonsense, we share agreement. As you small in, she don't deform politician. Maybe politician. You want the job from, from my salary. Now me and you don't do the work. But now we bring you inside this compound now. We had an agreement. You bring me come this compound. We had an agreement. Me, I don't terminate that agreement. You too small to do that kind of thing. Why would you chop my salary? What I tell you, say, don't worry, I will still touch you. Come on for you. Come on for you. You know it's sack me. Yeah. Who pay me salary now, man? No, I can't pay me. And I got all of me for you. No, I got all of me. I got all of me, what? You see that this way, you pay? That's this, eh? I will put you for bad. Carry you go through the way or get you a blue. Nothing will happen. Nobody going to, the world not going to say something lost. Yeah. Baby politician. 
You be politician. As you small rich, you want the job of not my salary. Let me. No, no, you know that you do small for this thing what you do. Huh? Baby. Baby chef. Baby politician. Come on from here. Baby chef. Ihoma. Ihoma. Wow. Such a beautiful name for a beautiful girl. Thank <laughs> you. So tell me, how old are you? I'm 13 years. 13? Yes. And you're hooking? What a pity. Can you imagine how, how wicked some people can be? Such a tender age and she's already hooking on a major road. Seriously? I mean, this, this innocent girl should be in school by now. Of course. You know, I feel like getting those people arrested. I mean, this is wickedness. Sir, please, I beg of you. I prefer to stay in the village than to, than to stay with them. Please, sir. Please, please, please. It's okay. All right, um, no problem. Um, this is my wife, Marian. Okay. We actually came to discuss with the doctor, okay, so as to know when um, you'll be discharged. I mean, how long you're supposed to stay in the hospital. Okay, my wife is actually suggesting that um, you stay with us, you stay in my house, okay, <laughs> while you go through the, um, the healing process. So as soon as you recover fully, I will take you to your parents in the village. But first, I will have to see those idiots, those useless people that you were staying with. Okay, thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you. It's okay. Mm -hmm. Listen, I promise you. You'll be fine. I am going to take good care of you. Okay? I am going to make sure that I take good care of you, make it up to you for the pains we've cost you. Is a promise, okay? <laughs> Thank you, sir. I miss you. You're welcome, my dear. You're welcome. Please, can you lock the door? Lock the door, please. Am I safe? So I said, I'm going to go. I hope all is well. I'll pass you, Sha. What did you Don't I know you? You know me now. Let me be CSO for gates here. The last time when you come, let me open gates for you. Where you and my younger day the drink. No. That's not what I mean. I know you. As a matter of fact, you are the person I saw at Dino's Clubhouse. <laughs> Dino's Clubhouse. Mary Judah laugh for work our club. Sorry, sir, not be me. You are mistaking me for someone else, or you are mistaking someone else for me. I know they go club. If you see me, the only time where I go club now for my dream. Yes. By the dream, I see where the boy will be good boys for club. But if I wake up, I go rest. Don't be me. I don't I don't eh? You know about the reserve water for there? Who, who will pay? Ali? Yes, sir. I guess I'm wrong. So, what of your guy? Our guy come out very early in the morning. He said he gave business meeting for office. So, he come out early. Oh, okay. Okay. Then I'll meet him at the office then. Right. Anything for the boys? Some other time. Alright, sir. How do I look? Am I hot? What am I hot? This is all money can do. Are you kidding me? Do you if my husband sees you this way, he will kill you. Calm down, your husband, you know what they I know what they do now. I want to hurt. What about the cook? The cook? The cook will tell him just cooking. If I, if I punch that cook, 
the cook should mind her business. Tell me now, I hope I'm hot now. When I'm hot, check me out now. See, I want to ball out like this. We get party, and I want to step in there based on show stop home. You never know to move. Oh, oh, I no more. So tell me now, I hope I'm hot. Yes, you're hot. Why not hot? Yes, you're, you look very good. Can you go now, please? <laughs> Coming just, from you. Just go. Nice. I want to. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, but, 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 but what about my rappers, the one of last night? Have you taken care of them? I don't run now. You don't run now. Hey, that one, I got you now. Don't worry, I got you. 100% I got you. Okay. Chop no color. Chop no color. Bullish green. <laughs> The baby celebrity gets mad. Ibu ba kariaga. The baby celebrity gets mad. Ibu kwa mwa bia. Spending chop money. Onye jeko deli. Ibu ba kariaga. Akuna taka si nomzo. Um, see Fred. I could swear that the young man I met at the club. Was the same man I saw at your gate that I came to your house. <laughs> you know, Mark, um, if not that I know you, but well, I mean, I know you too well. I would have said, um, you're not a stand up comedian. Because, of course, you're, <laughs> you're cracking me up. <laughs> what is the link? I mean, what is the connect? A gate man and a clubhouse. What is the connection? Do you know how much I paid the bill? Do you know how much it takes as a salary? <laughs> Come on, where would you say the money is going to club with, according to you, balling, balling in club? This young man works for me, okay? I mean, he's my gate man. He works for me Monday to Sunday, morning to night. He doesn't want a shift. Okay, he's always at home. He's always in my house. So, come on. If at all he has any time at all, it's probably when he's running around to my wife. So, where is the time to go to club and all the balling we're talking about? I hope I like the money. No, but when person eat, you will see money to ball. <laughs> I, I understand what you're saying. It's just that the striking resemblance is what is confusing me. Moreover, that is the kind of client that you need. I wish you met that young man. What did he say the young man was doing again? Was um, spending money? He was not spending money. That guy was balling. As a matter of fact, he shut down the club. Mm. I'm telling you, <laughs> you need to see that man. You, you know, I'm, I'm wondering why you stopped going to club. Huh? Eh? Mark, we should not go about this again. Okay, look. I have told you before, I am now a married man, okay? And as such, I should live a responsible life. Hmm? Um, better. better. You're a hustler. A businessman, Fred. And the kind of business you do requires you to seek people at any way, at any point in time, including club. Okay? So I think you should make out time once in a while at least to go to club. Think about it. That is where you can meet the kind of client that you, you, you are looking for. Well, I, I, I think you have a point. You know, I think you're right there. Yeah. You know, maybe one of these days I will just um, make out time you know, for us to go to club. Very important. But that will be after discussing with my wife, okay? Because you know, of course, I I owe her the obligation of telling her every of my movements. Child, marriage man. <laughs> no, oppress me now. Rub it on my face or tell me, Mark, you can't get married. <laughs> no, no, now because every little thing, married man, I need to tell my wife. Mm -hmm. I need to seek permission from my wife. No, tell me now, I should can't get married. Of course, you should go. Why are you waiting for me to say it? You should go and get married. I only told you two years from now. Okay. <laughs> but you need to see that guy. You need to see that. That guy has money. The guy has excess money, excess doings. Okay, 
I called you here to let you know that I believe what you told me. I believe what you told me about the baby, being a cultist. Oh, you believe? Yeah. Thank God. Hey, I'm glad you believe now. Yeah. I believe because I've been having these strange dreams. Very strange, Joe. And even a prophet. A prophet told me that Zubim is a cultist, that I should chase him out of my house. That prophet may fall now. In fact, I'm in support of it. Uh, um, but there is a problem. Oh. What's the problem? You know Dubim is a very strong man. Chasing Dubim out of this house is not going to be that easy. Uh -uh. I don't understand. Even Madame, la. I don't know what to chase out. I had the best go one. Uh, it won't be that easy oh, because of my husband. It won't be that easy. Uh, hey. oh, what should we do? Um, what we should do now is up to us. Uh, both of us. Me, you. Me no, and that's you. an us. Yes. Oh. Um, what I'm trying to say is we have to kill him. <coughs> Stop shouting. He. Yes. Wait now. He's a strong person. We can't just chase him out of this house. Oh. We have to destroy him. We have to kill him. I mean like murder. Yes, like kill him. Kill him. Kill him. I don't want to just go, go. Go and think about it. Yeah? yeah. You know, Jimmy the, the is a smart guy. Yes. I'll tell him to say if I put some ticker about Are you stupid? It'll be very easy. You're mad. Which one is telling to be? Are you stupid? Yes. I say you, you just go. Go and think about it. Yeah? Just you. You alone. You alone. Alone. Don't tell Dubim more. Don't tell Dubim. Hi! What kind of useless boy is this? Are you sure I made the right decision? Mwa lakta kwa na mna bezi mbiko. Nanda, don't see you. And she must talk. If you are doing something, it takes time nobody sees you. Nanda, don't see you. She don't get the respect for you. There's no extra left in the pot. So keep your extra stomach to yourself. I'm not talking about food now. You know every time I'll be talking about food. I'm here for serious business. I am not in the mood for any discussion. I am very busy. Wait, 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 wait. I'm not. Uh, I, won't, I won't ask you question. What is it? Uh, you, you don't keep asking me. Hey! This guy didn't come out. He didn't come out well. Do you want to kill? No, I mean... I mean he, he got anything with you make. Good person, suddenly turn evil and won't keep Nothing should make a good person suddenly turn bad and want to kill somebody. Except that person has been bad from the beginning. Nothing should make you think of killing anybody, no matter the provocation. Oh. Stay away from that photo. Look, look at this. Thank you. What Thank are you up to? I'm not going to my bad, that's all I need to hear. Thank you. I'm the one in the secret place of God. This man. What is wrong with you? Eh? What is wrong with you? Eh? I, I, I don't understand. Ma. You don't understand. So you went to seek advice from the cook. You think she's not going to tell me? No, ma, I, I was confused, so I needed clarification. No, you, you needed clarification. Clarification on what? It's not that we are, he's even a good man. He's not even a good man. We're getting rid of a bad man. And you need clarification. Sorry, ma. I'm sorry. Sorry for yourself. So, so no, you, you want to tell me, you, you want that dream you had. That dream, seeing him killing you in the dream, you want it to come to pass. Go for baby. Eh. I'm the only child of my late parents. Eh. You don't want to die. You don't want to die, okay? Yeah? Eh. Then do the needful. 
Do the needful. If not, you will die. I'll do it. You do it. Uh, it's not like I'm even begging. I'll, I'll do it. I'll do it. Mm, mm. You do it. You said he likes Melinda, right? Yes. He likes Melinda. Mm. Give this to you. Give him this. If, if, if I slap you, you want to open it. You know you like food. You like food. But you don't have to like this one. This one is not your food. This food is for Dubé. I repeat. This is not for this you. This is for the babe. What did I say? This is for the babe. Don't drink it. Give it to the babe to drink. Or you are good. This my life. We are full final. You know, Sabi greets again, Abi. I don't know, good evening. Add family. You know, say your mouth, know the day one place. If you like, go report me to Organ, madam. Say I get the food. I can't go with you. Nothing will happen. You will not be reporting me that day now. Now, beg you, mood. I can't make peace with you. Say, I just sorry. I just stupid and greedy those days. So, now I won't, I won't come beg me to give. And now you won't apologize, make peace. You, you with my guy, where are the love and respect? Because say you, you link me up, I get job. You won't begin from Don Jazzy for my head. Small time they form a guy. No, I shall not now. Oh Allah now. You know my person, I appreciate you. Let by one be bad. You say I appreciate say you carry me come here. I appreciate you. No, I will you for no say I don't care for you. Oh Allah, I know you are good. See, I don't forgive you, I will still show you love. Um, do that thing. Why? What do you have? Because she... If you think it's secret. Secret? Yeah. I know. It matters a lot. It has gotten to this point. Huh? I mean, you won't kill me. No, 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 you won't kill me. I get on time. I get on time. Yes, darling. Um, um, it's the gate man. He, he came to make a delivery. I sent him somewhere. What's all the noise for? Ah, uh, he's your stupid gate man. Mm -hmm. I asked him to go buy me a recharge card. I gave him 2,000 naira to go buy me a recharge card. He said, oh, get it there. He had gone short. He ran away and threw away my 2,000 naira. I don't understand. You sent the gate man to go buy you what? Yes. To go buy a recharge card? Yes. <laughs> You're so funny. Oh, I mean, this is 21st century, this is a jet age and you're still buying a recharge card when you can easily do a top-up with your phone. You can buy online. <laughs> Hi, my love, seriously. I forgot. I don't even know what I was thinking. Mm. I don't know. Can you imagine? I have my phone, I have everything, I have... This stupid boy. Do you know, I gave him another 2,000 naira. Mm? Yes, to buy me another one. To buy me a recharge card. <laughs> Let me quickly go and collect it. Okay. Oh? I'm coming. I'll okay. be with you soon. You, 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 you evil woman. I'm sorry. Nami, you won't kill. No. Nami, you won't kill. No. Let me go first meet that. Sorry. Even I'm sorry. I promise. I didn't know what came over me. I'm not like this. Sorry for your miserable self. 
You think so I can get evil mind like you? Me, I mean you won't kill. You never see something. You never see something. For this thing what you do here, eh, I swear you go suffer, 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 till your last day on earth. <laughs> Come, I'm going to need that for. Listen and listen real good. Before the week runs out, I need 3 million naira. 3 million naira. I don't care how you will raise it. Else, I swear, I will not only expose you, I will tell your husband everything and also show him the poisoned drink. I'm sorry. Okay, now, now. You want to kill me? You! You! One week! I don't care how you raise that money. After one week, eh? In fact, you go there internet. I'm sorry, please. Give me the money. Chimo, Chimo. Give me the money. I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. Oh, oh, yeah. Honey, I mean, there's something I want to get. What is it? Are you having any problem with this little boy? Can you hear yourself? Me having a problem with a little boy. What's my business with him? I have no business with him. The only thing I said, he should move out of the room. Honey, because I don't understand this your mood. I mean, the anger. The tone at which you're talking about moving these things. Come on, what what do you have with this little boy? No, what are you even saying? What are you saying? What is this boy doing in this house? Absolutely nothing. Nothing. He should move his things out of that room, please. Alright, no problem. I'll see you when I come back from work. Okay. Hello. Love you too. Bye. I wanted to have a word with you before I leave. Thank God you're here. Um the little girl will be coming to live with us. Okay, I mean, she'll be coming to spend some days here with us. Okay? So I asked uh, Auntie Edna to move your things from your room to another room. I hope you don't mind. Yes, sir, I don't mind. Nothing. Okay. I just thought I should tell you. Okay? I, 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 I want to show you something. You want to show me something? Yes. What is that? Hold on, I'll bring her. Hold on. What no nonsense is this? Hey, I will. Hmm. My God, you win! Okay, who is related on this rapper? I don't know. You don't know? No, maybe not rich get money. Who dumped them? I don't know. What my do you mean? I don't know. Who dumped the rappers? You're saying you don't you know? You might be the celebrity get money, man. Who are you calling celebrity get money in my house? To be um, get money all your user for that thing. Now get money. What call to be for me? Okay, sir. Fast! Call to be for me. What nonsense is this? You did what? I said to Honey, can you imagine? Look at this. Is this not my best shit and your rappers? Oh my goodness. The worst of it all is that they are even smelling urine. Urine? Akrika, what did you do with the best shit I asked you to give to the bane to wash for me when he returns? Ask me. You don't give me any best shit though. What? Are you calling me a liar? No, Akrika, are you calling me a liar? No, so I gave you the shit to give to the game to wash for me and you have the guts to pee on it? I don't, you know, you may, I don't pee on it. I, I... Oh my goodness. He... Oh, oh, oh. Will shut up? How dare you? How dare you call my wife a liar? You stupid. I'm not gonna lie. You know not... what? I've had enough of this, your nonsense attitude in this house. In fact, this is the peak of it. I won't take this nonsense anymore from you. I don't want to see you anywhere in my house again. You hear me? I don't want to see you when I return. No. Pack your things and get out. Don't let me see you here when I return. Nonsense. Please. Hey. Young man, you heard him. He said you should leave. So, vamos. Stand up. I should have known who you are. Thanks for deceiving me. 
I'm having pity on my boss who haven't seen the real you. I'd rather leave this house than to turn to your for you. I cannot kill you. I know you are hiding some things. I know you are mission in this house. But I pray God exposes you soon before you hurt someone. Get out. Get out. I'll leave. I say out of my house. Get I'll out. Leave. I said shut up! Leave my house! You! Rubbish! You go they put mouth for matter where tongue pass you. You don't know say they only put mouth for husband and wife matter because they go use you settle in the end. Man, they don't psych you. You wear like food. I want to survive. I beg, I won't make you know say that woman too wicked. She wicked die. That was our story now. I know. That woman is wicked and evil at the same time. And they avoid her. Wow. I beg. If you have me advice or that, or how you wife did, if you do that one, I will do all right any right here. And then your advice don't worry. Talk more of me advice or that. That will not concern you. I don't give you that kind of advice. My concern is to say, how you want to survive now? You wear like food. I will. You don't know, get food. You can't food where they get there. No, you're not going to be ready for Sorry, yeah? Bye bye. What, you, you, you don't chop today? I'm not chopping. What do you want to chop? I want to chop in the middle. Well, eh? Today, what do you do? Today! I'm going to open the gate. Are you deaf? Oh, yeah? Jesus. Seriously. Are you sleeping? Yes. It Professor. Where were you last night? Huh? Where were you last night? L last night, okay? I think you're all true. Are, are, you, are you crazy? Are you saying I'm lying? No, it's not like you're lying, sir. Were you here last night? Yes, I came out here at 2 a.m. I didn't see you. I initially heard noise at the gate. I came out to see things for myself and you were nowhere to be found. Okay, maybe it was that time that the police came and interrogated what? me. You know, they police? run for this estate yesterday. What? Ah! They're robbed now. Look, it's more gunshot. Too. You know, yeah, I didn't hear anything. I, I didn't hear any noise. Uh, any gunshot. Okay, they robbed some people last night around that kind of midnight. So, police came, called me, asked me some few questions, interrogated me. We went to the scene and came back. They said the they come back. Yes, no. How come I didn't hear any? In that case, please make sure this gate is always locked. I mean, locked 24 hours. I'm at your service, sir. That thing will happen overnight. We took almost two hours. That's why this morning now. I'm having my game plus. I'm so sorry about your health, okay? Open the gate for me. Okay. Um, hey. Um, you can go back to sleep or do that for just three hours. I don't want anybody looking for you. Thank you, sir. Well, we are together, sir. You don't think she's having an affair? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I just feel there's something off about her attitude. I don't, I don't just know. I believe she's not being honest with me. But the truth of the matter is that your wife doesn't look like someone who is having an affair outside her marriage. And who is talking about my wife cheating? Of course I know my wife is not having an affair with anybody. I am, ju I am just bothered that something, I mean, something is not right. 
something is not just right, but I, ju I just can't place it. Okay, fine. Did you try talking to your cook? I, I remember you told me you are one of your friends. Maybe she has something to tell you. That's what baffles me. I mean, yes, we are friends. And she practically tells me everything. But I am surprised she has not told me anything about my wife. If she has not told you anything about your wife, when she practically tells you everything that happened in the house, does it mean that she's keeping something about your wife away from you? You know, Mark, I, I don't know. I mean, I don't even know what to think anymore. Because the more I think, the more confused I become. Then you should stop thinking. Oh yes, uh, maybe it's... Maybe it's, it's not something to, to be worried about. Okay? Maybe you are just being worked up over some irrelevant issues. Okay? You just have to stay positive. Probably she may be going through a lot. You know women now. Maybe she's having some things. Probably she's in that situation where she wants to be alone for a while. You know? All you need to do is just give her time. She'll still come around. Okay? So how did you help me? Are you going to go this evening? You know the last time I checked, you don't know how. Say something that is bothering me. Talk about color. Are you okay? I just want to cheer you up. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I know send you. Don't they give me food again? See, I get prostitution with you. And they see like best they won't poison me. I'm not gonna eat your food again. Do you know I saw that bed sheet with you? I made a guy to sack a cracker. So what will you do? It's either you mind your business or you go tell Oga. Whichever way, I know send you. I don't care. Demon, why are you like this? Why are you being this secretive? I will come to the gate to see you as a gate man on his duty post. I will not see you. You'll be out there cruising on God's expensive cars. Yet I will ignore you. I will not say anything over it. I will keep quiet. Why? Are you the supervisor? I, did the dog ask you to investigate crime in this house? Your duty is to cook. So stay there. And for your information, I've told you. Stop feeding me. Stop bringing me food. I can survive without your food in this house. Because I have lost trust in you. Why are you causing trouble here? Why are you making this house very unconducive for people to stay in? Why? I am appealing to you. In God's name, don't cause trouble. My old guy, I know him even from childhood. He doesn't like trouble. He doesn't make trouble. He's a very peaceful person. Instead of you to come here to make trouble and cause problems for my old guy, do the honorable thing and resign. The honorable thing for you to do is to honorably resign and leave us in peace. Yes! Oh no, you will go away. What are you feeling like? Like o the chief cook. Oga's mother. Let me remind you. Not be you born Oga. You'll be ordinary cook for this house. Ordinary cook. So mind your business. Focus on your kitchen. Where is the smell of India ham coming from? Oh. I can perceive the smell of India ham. At this your age. You don't want to be for here. Come on for here now. What time say you they perceive India ham? Were you smoking it before? See, I...
You're home now. Uh, okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. Welcome. Thank you. Um, Ihoma. Meet uh, Edna, our cook. Okay. She's also a big auntie in the house. <laughs> <laughs> Edna, here it's um, Ihoma. The little um, girl I told you about. Wow! Hello, little girl. How are you? Hi, uh, it's nice to meet you, Ma. The pleasure is mine, too. She sounds so smart. Yes. And intelligent. Very. Yeah, very smart. Um, Edna, <laughs> like I told you, she'll be staying here with us until she makes full recovery. Okay. Okay. So, um,. You will take her to her room, prepare something nice for her to eat. And I'll be taking good care of her, I promise. <laughs> Don't worry, Homa. You see this house? I want you to take this house as your second home. Right. Okay? Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. Um, I said, now, please, can you get her something to eat? I will. Come, let me take you to your room. Take her to her room. Come. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> Oh, oh uh, honey. Yes. You know, I was thinking of um, getting her something to drink while she prepares a meal. Something to drink. Mm -hmm. Um, maybe you should get her something like Lokozet. Mm. That would be bad. That's perfect. Let me quickly ask um Dubim to get it for her. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Dubem! Please hurry up, hurry up, come. Please um, hurry up to that uh, spammer down there. Get me local service. Okay, sir. Okay, hurry up, please. One or two, sir. Um, two. Wait, come. What's, what's this, um, this smell? What's the smell I'm perceiving? Smell? Which smell? Wait. Is this not the smell of India hemp? Dubem, do you smoke? God forbid. Dubem, do you smoke in my compound? Me smoke. I'm allergic and I hate them. I can't smoke, sir. What is this I'm perceiving? Hey, hey okay. I said my mind my business, but I should not ask. Look at talk. You see this our name? The new gate man na chain smoker. He bought head potter. Morning afternoon night. You see this uncomfy? The work has been there here. Another segment of it. Every you go see one person, you go there for taking. You the other one go there for get. The other one go there. They are all smokers. Now, why did you tell me all this one? I say, make I mind my business. As for Mr. Carlo, I will talk to him. Is that he fires that gate man or he gets. I mean, he talks to him. I can't tolerate this nonsense. Imagine getting a visitor into my house and you are perceiving all this uh, India hemp smell. Okay, you are too fresh for this. Forget those people, they can be dangerous. Okay, so, these workers, which whenever you see them smoking, call my attention. Okay, I can't tolerate this anymore. I even. I nearly will beat that gate man. I warn them. I say, this thing is not good for your health. Okay, if you must smoke, say you are addicted. Go far away. Maybe near bush. Not around here. He said, okay, not so. Uh, not so, 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 Are you deaf? Okay, bye, go now. so, 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 Don't keep me waiting. I don't know if you will have time to listen to what I'm about to tell you. Come on, say now. What is it? See that burn boy. He smokes. 
You know the other time you asked me if he smokes? I told you I don't know. I even defended him. He smokes. <laughs> so you're just finding out now? Yeah. When I got to his side, it was causing of a uh, Indian ham. I perceived it. I mean, he smokes. <laughs> you got to his side. So, how sure are you he's the one smoking? I don't think we live in there. I am sure. Not talking like this. When I got there, I, even though I didn't catch him red handed, probably he must have thrown it away, where immediately he noticed I was coming. Because that place was filled with stench of Indian hemp. And then my mom Before he would be mad and slaughter us in this house. And you know, dear, would you know, dear? But I said, now you just said there is no proof. You didn't see him. Mm -hmm. That means you're not sure. Yes, there is no proof that he was the one smoking. Come to think of it. You know the kind of job he's doing? He's a gate man for crying out loud. Mm -hmm. Yes, that justifies him smoking. He may need to get high to effectively do his job. Why are you talking like this? Why is it that you don't see anything wrong whatever that boy does? Did he pay you to always defend him? Or be on his side? Eh? And said, no. Did you just raise your voice at me? I'm sorry, ma. I'm sorry. It will be good. I'm sorry. business do you have with the main building? Are you talking to me? Of course, yes. When I say don't get respected. If, if not that you're my niece, I, 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 I will give you the slap of yourself. Oh, now I'm, not, I'm now your niece. I thought you said I should treat you like a stranger. So you have no business coming in here to take a drink? I, I, I don't know. Your mates are sleeping. Go upstairs and sleep. I don't want to sleep. You cannot force me to sleep. Besides, when Oka comes back, I'm going to talk him into his drink. Eh? Mm. That means I will break your ankle. My ankle? You will hear today. Okay. Look at the type of hair she's got. The baby celebrity gets man. The baby celebrity gets man. The baby celebrity gets man. Spending chop money, celebrity gets mad. Chop money, spend money. And you see that uncle at the gate, he's very unfriendly. I don't like him. Did he say anything to you? He did not say anything to me, just that I don't like the way he behaves. I don't like him either. So we both do not like him. Try to avoid him, okay? Yes, he's a very bad man. Why did you say that? Do you know him before? No, it's just that I've seen someone like him in a movie and the person acts very evil and wicked. He's not an actor. He's just a gay man. I got what you're saying. Just don't mind him, okay? Okay. Do you ever want to go back to school someday? Yes, of course. That's always been my prayer to get back to school. Like, I've always been praying because I've missed a lot of classes. Consider that prayers answered. I will ensure you go back to school, at least to secure your future. Oh my God, Auntie, thank you so much. God bless you. You're welcome, darling. Thank you, God. Yeah. Thank you so much. Hey, darling.
Hmm? I don't please Andrew. Oh, please Andrew. What kind of dream is that? Hmm? It's okay, it's alright. Um I mean it's nothing to worry yourself about, okay? Let's get back to sleep. Mm -hmm. let's, let's, let's go back to sleep. Are you sure you're okay? I'm okay. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> what is what's funny? I mean, why are you making money? Uh, Allah, please, please stop. Stop this. <laughs> See, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. It's just that I can't stop imagining you on a get one cut outfit. <laughs> Mark, you know what I've seen? I, mean, I wish you could see me. I mean, I was looking so pathetic on that uniform in my own house. Really? I'm telling you. I mean, the one that even got me so bothered was he was seated here. He was sitting on my seat, giving me instructions as my new CEO. That was so funny. Why are you making that thing out of this? Why are you laughing? So, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, just that you are. The dream is funny. Eh? <laughs> Ah, this guy. The, the one that really got me bothered was I saw this young man knocking my wife. Your wife? He was making love to my wife! Fuck <laughs> <laughs> this, this, your laughter is beginning to, to piss me off. What's all this? Now? Why are you laughing? Fred, <laughs> you are funny. Don't you expect me to cry? You think it's funny? The truth of the matter is that you are taking this whole thing serious. It's just a dream. Eh? It's just a common dream. Come on, forget about it. Look, I, I, am, I am scared of this guy. Okay, I am I'm scared of him. Don't you think it's... It's high time I sacked him. Okay, no, no, it's high time I sacked him. But do you think he's, he's having an affair with my wife? Do you? Oh, come on, come on. Can you hear yourself? No, are you not just a dreamer? Because you had a dream that he was your CEO sitting in your office. I was knocking your wife, you want to sack your get man. It doesn't make sense now. Eh? Like I said, you don't allow it to, 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 to get on you. It's just a dream. Eh? That you had a dream this guy was knocking your wife. When you woke up, was he on top of your wife? No, did you see him on top of your wife? The answer is no. It's just a mere dream. Okay? <laughs> so, 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 Mark, what you're trying to say is that um, I shouldn't be bothered about the dream? Unless you want to give yourself a headache. You should not bother you. Or do you want to tell me you don't trust your wife? And I've also seen him smoking. You mean the gets man? Yes. Oh. Okay. Coming into this house to take drinks. He's an adult. He can come into this house, take drinks, okay? There's nothing wrong with that. My you're a very kind woman. But you're very careless. Um kind yes careless are you not being disrespectful i i didn't mean to say that just that 
you barely know him and you're allowing him to come too close into this family. Ihoma. Listen, my dear. This life isn't that hard the way you look at it. No. The reason for curse is lack of care, togetherness and support. We don't care for strangers, forgetting that we may need their help tomorrow. And how would you feel if they treat us as strangers the same way we treat them? Take yourself as an example. If my husband and I didn't take a chance on you, we wouldn't have brought you to our home because you are a stranger. But we reasoned above seeing you as a stranger. That's why we brought you to our home. That is called humility. See, we do not segregate. I mean, we don't set apart. We do not discriminate. We are one family. I want you to learn that. Okay? Okay. So cheer up. Have you eaten? Naira. Where do you expect me to get the money from? You know, see the only way that is. Read that complete. Three million naira only. Uh -uh. Have you not go to school again? Now only I put it there, so now only. Besides, for your question, I no care where you from bring the money. If you want to go bring the money, beautiful. If you want to go do runs, bring the money. Awesome. What I need is three million naira only. So I don't care how you raise the money. Why are you like this? Why are you like this? You know I didn't come to this house with any money. That means I will open my mouth and tell your husband. In fact, if I see your husband, I will open my mouth. Wah! And when I open my mouth, wah! You will have family problem. Wah! No, no, no. Please don't open your mouth. You will have conscience now. Have conscience. Who conscience help? No, tell me. Who conscience help? Listen, listen real good. Make sure you raise this money. Use your head and know which of your husband's property you will sell. Are you getting me? Because if you fail, oh. I will not only tell your husband that you bed wet, I will put Jara before telling him about the poisoned drink as well. Hey, hey. Be careful with me. no hospital I've not been to for treatment. Here it didn't work. I've lost all my relationships because of this same condition. I had no hope of having my own man. One day Fred's mother visited my village and saw me. She asked me to marry her son. At first I was scared because I know my condition. But my mom encouraged me and asked me to go on with it. But I had to promise her that I'll tell my husband about my condition immediately after the wedding. Till date, I couldn't tell my husband about it because I was scared of losing him. You said you knew the kid, man. Yes. To be was my childhood friend. But we've been enemies, though. 
I tried a relationship with him, but he backed out when he discovered I was bedwetting. He bullied me all through the village. One day, the uncle came and took him away. Ever since then, I never set my eyes on the pain. Get into this house. I saw the beam working as a kid's man. I tried. I tried everything to get him out of this house. But he treated me. He treated me that he was going to tell my husband the truth. And I know my husband, he, he would definitely call off the marriage and I wasn't ready for it. So tell me, what agreement did you reach with the get man? I made a promise that I was going to be giving him money whenever he asked for it. What? He would stop. He keep pushing me to do things I don't want to do. Oh my God! How I hate that monster boy! Listen, this is the time to muster courage and tell your husband everything about this. No, I can't, Antina, I can't. My husband is going to send me away. I can't do it. Is it better to continue to live this lie, stealing from your husband? I saw how you, you plan to sack Akrika. Yes, I did. Because Akrika refused poisoning the babe for me. <gasps> I'm glad he didn't do it. But I I wanted him out of the house. I wanted him to leave this house as a punishment for disobeying me. You went too far. I know. I could vouch that you are not like this. You are not this bad. I said no, I'm not like this, I promise. I'm not like this. You are. It was the babe that pushed me to no, do this. You were already a bad person when you concealed this truth from your husband, even before the babe came into the picture. I'm so disappointed at you. Come on. I said that, please. Please don't tell my husband about this. Please, I beg you. Please. Tell your husband. This is the only way out. I said that my marriage will be over already. Don't you get it? That is the only sure thing. The sureness of it all. Trust me. Just that you, you have become so committed to this Deben boy. I've always been seeing you. The way you give him money, be monitoring you. <laughs> I'd expected you to either open up to me or to your husband. But you decided to conceal this truth. <laughs> I only had to step up. When I noticed that you were getting into trouble, which you may not be able to come out from it. Until... <laughs> Tell me, how do I do this? How do I handle the babe? Tell your husband before it's too late. A stitch in time saves nine. Tell him. I got you something. See what I got you. Daddy, 
Piper. Mm -hmm. Are you serious? Oh, thank you. I'm used to it, but I, I don't want to use it here. Why? Because the urination happens mainly at night. That's the idea. You wear it only at night. Oh, I said no, no. What if my, my husband wants to have sex with me? Ah. Yes, and you know they, they normally request for sex at night or early in the morning. Oh my god, no. Nothing has spoiled yet. You wake up in the middle of the night after sex and wear it. Oh, but that's still, when there is no sex, you wait. Eh, eh. Now you have a point too. Okay. You have a point. I'll always help you to dispose of it so that your husband doesn't find out. But if you ask me, I will tell you to tell him more. He deserves to know what you're going through. And said now you're right, but I'm scared. Uh, I don't have the courage to tell him about it. You don't have the courage. You must have the courage. Eh? You must have it. Develop it. Um, okay, I'll try. I'll tell him. Thank you very much. I spoke to that evil kid, man. Dubem. Mm -hmm. What did he tell you? Listen, there, there is trouble. That lousy cook has found out that I'm the one washing your bed wet wrappers all this while. What you know? Dubem, how? How did she find out? Are you asking me? Have you forgotten how she behaved? No, tell me, why won't I ask you? Uh, if you have. If you have taken that wrapper immediately, I gave it to you to wash. You won't have seen it. Okay, I'm blaming you. Why would I blame you? See, this is not time to blame anybody. Else. You must know what to tell her. Else, she will tell your husband everything. Oh, really? So you want me to just go there and tell her the truth so she can walk straight to my husband and tell, tell him everything? Is that what you want? I'm not supposed to handle this thing. She can't be that woman. I don't think she can talk to me. Yes, she's very annoying. You're supposed to handle this. You're supposed to handle this. This is your job. What is your job? You're supposed to handle it and you're here telling me there is trouble. Oh. It's your fault. No problem. Only that woman confused her, lying for her. Else she will tell your husband. Why do you only need to go down? Okay. Fred. 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 Look at this. Look at what I saw. What is it? Look at it now. See your good man. This is not your good man. My good man? <laughs> Dubem, my gate man. Oh, come on, man. This is not my gate man. Look at what I'm showing you now. Look at the people. My friend, look at the picture. Look at the forehead. I don't see it. Eh? I said, look at the picture. You're looking at me. Look at the man. Look, look. I don't see it. Look very well now. Mark, I'm surprised at you. I mean, I'm surprised you're the one saying this. How can you say this is my gate man, Dubem? Look, no, no, look, look at this picture very well. How can you say this is... How can this be Dubem? This is not my gate man for crying out loud. Look, yes, there might be some sort of resemblance, yeah? But, come on. This is not my gate man. Okay? I'm, I'm so shocked at you. We all have our lookalikes, okay? It's a matter of time you get to see yours. So, please. This that cannot be my Dubem. You know what you're talking about, Dubem? Let's go see food chop with just like that. Okay. The, the resemblance is really striking. Mm. This is the same guy I told you that I only saw in a club. This is him. It's Dubem. Ma, can you stop saying it's Dubem? <laughs> this is not Dubem. Yes, they, are, they look alike. But stop saying it's Dubem. This cannot. Do you know what Dubem wore to my house the very day I employed him? One dirty, haggard looking t shirt and one funny tie. <laughs> Where Dubem see money by all this thing? This, 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 this clothes. Come on, please. Say something else about it. Don't be distracted. Look, I have so much to do. Hey! I had a dream where you gave birth to twins. <laughs> Are you serious? I know it would be nice now. Yes, mm -hmm. I love it. 
Oh, that would be so amazing. Uh -huh. They were so adorable and beautiful. You see? Oh, shit. Why would I... they be beautiful? Uh huh. Am I not pretty? Oh, please. Am I not beautiful? Oh, dear, I'm not handsome. <laughs> you know? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, honey, you know what? Um, what? Since you, you love them as much as I do. Yes, of course. Okay. Um, we have to get to work. Get to work? I, I don't understand. What do you mean by that? We have to get to work right now. Like, right now. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't mean it. Like Stop it! I want to pee. Yes, I'm um, seriously pressed. I, I want to pee. Look at the twig. Look at the twig. I know it's it, it, that bad. I, I, I can't wait. I need to pee, okay? Alright. I'll be right back. Okay. I'll be with you. Sure. Okay. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. I will. I'll be with you. Sure. Okay. Honey, hurry up, please. I'm coming. Good morning, Samson. Good morning, my baby. How's your night? Good morning, my angel. My night was beautiful. I mean, it was very beautiful. Knowing that you stood by my side. <laughs> Don't make me cry. <laughs> wow, it's morning already. Yes. You know, I have, I have a presentation today at the office to make. Oh, really? I'm going to quickly make something for you to eat. Don't no worry, honey. Don't you know, worry. Huh? No, you have to eat something. I'm coming. No, no change of 90. But what change? <laughs> I mean, as usual, you, you change your 90 every night. Yes, I know. But I'm tired of doing the same thing over and over again. I know. Out of it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Embrace the new me. <laughs> 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 Do you know, I never slept in a long time since I entered this house, if not recently. Thank you so much, Auntie Edna. Thank you. You're a lifesaver. I wonder what took me so long in wearing diapers. <laughs> you were scared. Anyway, it's not easy to have such a condition. But I still don't think your husband will send you away if he gets to find out. Auntie Edna, you can't blame me. You can't blame me for being skeptical about this. Because I've lost relationships because of this. Come here. Yeah, I know. You still cannot know how your husband will react if he finds out. But I want to assure you something. Look at me very well. I will always be here to defend you by talking to your husband. <laughs> I want you to tell him yourself. I don't want to tell him. I don't want to be the one to bring him in to know him what you're passing through. Because if I do, he won't believe anything I say. <sighs>
and said, no, I'll try. Just that I don't have the courage. Hey, Anne. Tell him before it's too late. Because it will be disastrous if he finds out himself. Okay. Oh. So how much? One hundred and eighty million. It's all right. No, 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 no. There's no problem. <laughs> yeah, it's true. It's called for celebration. Yeah, maybe by tomorrow, we just hang out, you know, and celebrate, okay? Oh, yeah. All right, thank you very much. Yeah, you hear from me soon. All right. Yeah. <laughs> My brother. Congratulations! <laughs> A big one at that. Congrats, 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 congrats. I'm so happy for you. Yeah. I'm so happy for you, man. Congrats. I'm so happy, Ben. <laughs> um, the thing is, Fred, this contract is um something I've been working on for past few months now. But um, thank God they just um awarded me the contract. But I would like you to assist me with some money. So that I can um, sort out with the people that help me um, get the contract. Okay, so um, you need money to sort people that gave you the contract. <laughs> what sort of contract? <laughs> no, it's not the people that gave me the contract. Okay. Rather than the people that help me, people that help me to do the underground work okay. uh, to, to to secure okay. the contract. All right, no problem. So, um, how much are we looking at here? Like 20 million naira. Yeah, but you're not actually made the money. Mm. I will pay you back. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I have the money from you, you're not paid. 20 uh, million naira. Uh, this one is business. business. You understand? Uh, I will surely pay you, I'm serious. Okay. So, um, when exactly do you need the money? Um, uh, let me say by weekend. So, um, by Friday, I hope it won't be late. No, perfect. All right, fine. Thank you, man. I'll make you money available for you by Friday. Oh, thank you very much. Congratulations. <laughs> Congrats. This calls for celebration. Yeah, okay. yeah. All right. Um, I'm on that in Fred. Um, have you made any attempt in investigating your get man Dubem regarding all the things I've been telling you about him? Mark, you know, um, in as much as I know you as a, a very good friend, I mean, you see things and you see them the way they are, but this one, trust me, it's not one of them, okay? That person is not the baby. <laughs> I mean, come on, my kid, man. It's, remember that other day you called me and you said you saw him at the clubhouse? Okay. The baby was standing right in front of me, I said, in my house. So how are you supposed to, I mean, how are you supposed to place that? Is it some sort of uh, Holy Spirit or something? Appearing in two places at the same time. <laughs> Please, I beg, I beg. I beg. Yeah, I'm, just, I'm just showing concern. Just wipe that off your, your chest. Let me get you something for us to celebrate today. It's all right. right. <laughs> it's all right. It's just, um... All right. Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, for you. And uh, it's for me. Cheers. And cheers to... to more money. More money and more contract. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> cheers. <laughs> I'm so happy for you, man. Yeah, I'm so happy for you, man. Yeah, I'm so happy. You don't think he's the one, do you? That sounds ridiculous. Do you mean he's just an ordinary gay man? It's nothing to think of. That's exactly what I told my friend, Mark. But I, I don't understand why he doesn't want to accept. I don't understand, Mark, either. I don't get it. 
Mark has been to this house several times and saw Dubim at the gate. So what is he trying to say? I wish... I wish I know. I mean, yes, I mean, yes, he looks so much like um, the guy in the magazine. Okay, but come on. I mean, we do have our lookalikes, even though we're not uh, related or connected in any way. But exactly my point. We all have our lookalikes. That we haven't met them yet doesn't mean they don't exist. They do. You have, I have, everybody. We have our lookalikes. Yes. <laughs> I can't wait to meet your lookalike. <laughs> I just can't wait. Really? I, of course, I know it's not possible. Mm -hmm. What are you going to do with her? Nothing. Maybe just to ease my curiosity, you know. <laughs> <laughs> of course, I, I know, I know certainly that God created you just for me, okay? Just one. Original. No carbon copy, no fake, no duplicate. Why are you always like this? <laughs> Why? You always make me shy, mm. make me blush. Mm. Why are you always like this? Because. What about Sihoma? What has she done? She has not done anything wrong. Okay. It's just that uh, so I don't know your intentions as returning her to her people or her people wanting her to continue to live here as away from the village. If they still want her to continue to be with us, I want to make a special appeal to you. Can I be allowed to adopt her? Adopt her? S sorry, sir. S sorry, ma'am. I'm sorry I'm presenting it this way. You both know my story. As regards to my relationship and marriage, which has both failed, all of them failed. And I've lost chances and hope of childbearing due to my age. I am asking if you can help adopt that girl for me as well. I promise to take care of her very well. And I'm ready to release her to go see her parents anytime she wishes to go see them. Even if adopting her will not work. Can please go to a motherless baby's home and adopt a girl child for me. I'm not getting any younger. Let me see someone that will help me go through this old age. Please. Okay. Um, that's no problem. Have you have you spoken with the little girl? No, I have not, sir. I need to seek your consent first. Okay, um, but you still need to talk with her. Okay, you need to discuss with the little girl. At least let's know her, um, let's know her decision on this subject. Okay, it's, that way it will um, it will help us. In fact, to make things easier when discussing with her parents. Oh, okay, sir. Uh, Auntie Edna. Yes, ma'am. You are a wonderful woman, and I wish you all the best. You deserve to have a child, a child that is going to take care of you during old age. Hey. I just wish and hope she will accept you. I didn't see this one coming up. <laughs> Thank you, ma'am. Sir, you're such a lucky man. You indeed married a beautiful soul. Look at her. Beautiful in and out. <laughs> Thank you so much, ma'am. <laughs> uh, sir, can I retire to my quarter? Uh, of course, yes. But for all the hours you've been calling me, I am deducting 10,000 naira from your salary. And as for me, I am deducting 15,000 naira from your salary. Sorry, ma'am. You're still calling me, ma'am. Oh. Mary Ann. Mm. Yes, ma'am. Mary Ann. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, you can go now. Thank you, ma'am. <laughs> we are joking! <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Yo, 
young man. Say what you want to say. I don't have all. Relax now, madam. Relax. Every time your blood go there hot, you they take something that you they sleep something. Which one? Relax, my old woman. Don't insult me, I'm not your mate. Don't insult me. Meto Sele, I don't say we will not be mate. Relax. Forget that this is you they form hard woman. Every time you lock up your face, they form tough woman, hard woman. I don't scan you spiritually. I use my scanner, scan you. I see your heart. You be better person. You be better person. So no, they form hard for nothing. Uh, I think you get my family. That thing where you see. The bedwetting matter now. Mm -hmm. The issue at hand. Mm -hmm. The talk of town. Mm -hmm. It's a disgusting problem, but code it for us. I shouldn't tell Oga. Don't tell Oga. Uh, Don't even tell Oga's shadow. And uh, what if I decide to tell him? What will you do? Are you that wicked? Don't you keep a secret? When you were maneuvering it and Doing all the rubbish with it. What were you thinking? Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. I know so you like money. Make I package you. I will give you five hundred thousand. What? Keep it a secret. Five hundred k. That's not. What an insult! Why are you degrading me like that? Eh? Please stop. Ah ah. See, cook with pride, though. Five hundred k no move you. Okay, bye. I want. I want make you keep that secret. I go make a one million for you. But no tell on God what you see. Do them. I may be a cook. But I am way richer than I can imagine. So I don't need your money. 500, 10 million, go away with your money. I don't need it. I'm not a hungry cook. So what do you want to do? Hey, what do you want to do? Any more progress? You know, you know if you keep the discipline. If you know what is good for you, you pack your things and leave. Before Oga, now that you can pack your things, so back and leave before Oga comes back. Because when he does, you are your own. Now I'm saving you. So I have a good heart. Is that good heart I'm using to tell you now? Leave. Now cook, you be. Go. Go the phone, madam. Now ordinary cook, you be. You don't do anything. Ordinary security can't keep. I have gone outside several times at night, I mean, for some days now. It's always there. Nice. So that means he's not the one sneaking out? No, 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 I don't think so. I feel it's just um, accusations and um, assumptions. Okay, yes, sir. Uh, he might be acting weird, okay? I mean, he might be acting stupid sometimes, but come on. He hasn't given me any reason to distrust him. He hasn't done anything whatsoever to distrust him. But there's something I've not said. Something like what? Edna said that Dubim offered her one million naira to keep her mouth shut. What? One million naira? So keep quiet on what exactly? Hey, do you know how much you just mentioned now? One million naira. <laughs> oh, please. Do you know what one million naira can do? <laughs> I mean, where can you get one million naira from? Dubim has one million naira still working for me as a gate man. <laughs> please, please, please. It's not possible, okay? Enough of this uh, accusation and assumption. Enough of it already. <laughs> It's not possible and uh, seriously, I, I'm confused. The, this whole thing is confusing. I don't know this. My love, there is nothing confusing here, okay? I mean, there is nothing com confusing as far as I'm concerned. I believe you guys are just seeing things from different perspective. <laughs> One million there. <laughs> oh, please. Um... Oh, no good, Diego. Man of doings. 
Nah. I greet you gallantly. No, my man, no. I greet you, sir, but I don't know you. Ah, uh ah. -uh. Now, me, now. Nah. You forget. Dubai Clubhouse. Even here, you know me. Even in Eliego. Yes, Ego. King of Dreams. Mark. Make King of Dreams. Where are you going King of Dreams? Sorry, sir. Now, NSC. Black Label. Jameson. Ah, ah. By Azu. Are you now? I ah, I know you now. You now, oh boy, now those kids now, those kids, bobo, man of doing. Sorry, sir. Okay, Uma. I don't know you, brother. If you know, hey, to this guy is Eliego. This guy is the biggest man in town. Chidi, you are mistaking him for someone else. That was the same thing I thought the first time I met him. As a matter of fact, this is the Fred get man. Make I tell you today. God bless you, sir. This one are those kids now. Go back to your go back to your duty. He's not the one. I, I thought the same thing the first time I met him. As a friend now. Fred. I was even arguing with him in his office. I don't know. He's not the one. You don't finish yourself, didn't you? What are you doing? Even though he made the doing. Don't leave. 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 Don't le
<laughs> as your wife, girlfriend or what, that should be seen around you all the time. As someone that knows your secret. Mm. As someone that knows you bed wet. Mm. As someone that has refused to cast you in front of your husband and the general public. Mm. <laughs> Meanwhile, we get doings on Saturday. So I need one million naira. You need one million naira mm. for doings? Yes. What do you need doings? Even more wins. For what? Why would I give you one million naira? Let me ask. Yes. The play. No, just the play. Mm. Are you giving me the money or not? Why would I give you? Listen, Dubin. I don't want to see you in my room again. The next time I will see you in this room again, you will not only do your doings in the club, you will do that doings inside the police cell. Don't try me. Don't. You are asking me, Dubem, mm. to leave your room. Leave. Get out. Are you aware that if I cast you, you will lose everything? I'm aware. I'm aware. Is it not you? Dubem that knows that I bed wet. The Dubem that washes my clothes. The one that washes my wrapper. I know. And I am telling that same Dubem to leave my room. Get out. If not, that doings, you will do it in the police cell. Trust me. Bye, Awa. If, if, if. Nonsense. Celebrity gets man. Pretend that now you do the worst. I do the chop and kill him out. The bam celebrity get man. Oh. Why is your foot like this? What's what for the Talk to me, what is it? I would like to tell you something. Okay, go ahead. I'm listening. Just Promise me you won't be mad at me, please. Mad at you? Why? <laughs> there is nothing you would do or say to me that would make me get mad at you. Okay? I mean, why? What for? I can't get mad at my... I mean, the mother of my unborn child. Okay, so feel free to tell me whatever it is. Share it with me. Huh? Go ahead. I, I want it. I... Mm -hmm. Say it, honey. Say it. I want to tell you that I... You. I, I broke your flowers. I mistakenly broke your flowers. I'm, I'm sorry, it wasn't intentional. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I come on. You're not mad. Why? <laughs> I was joking, okay? Hey, I was joking, okay? Of course I'm not mad at you. It's something I can replace, so why would I be mad at you? Why? 
there's no way I will be mad at you for breaking the flower vase. Okay. Alright. Mm -hmm. So next time, feel free to tell me anything. Anything at all that's bothering you. They always share it with me. Right? I am very scared the baby is going to tell my husband everything. Are you calm down? Just calm down. I'm not going to tell your husband one word. Calm down. I think that he's serious. He's very serious. When I told him that I'm not going to give him more money, he told me that he's going to walk straight to my husband and expose me. He said that he would do it. He's very serious. Ma'am, believe me when I tell you he is not going to utter a word to your husband. Because he will be at the losing end. All hope of exploiting and getting money from you will be lost. And he wouldn't want to, to experience that. But this is the perfect time to tell your husband yourself. I've tried. This morning I tried telling him about it, but I was scared. I, I tried. I, I couldn't even open my mouth. I couldn't even tell him the truth. I'm scared. I'm Mom. going to lose my money. I'm going to lose Tell him before it's too late. Now you're still in this marriage. Anything you need to do to save this marriage, begin to do it now. Okay. Tomorrow may be too late. Okay. Okay. I'm going to lose my marriage. I'm not going to that. lose your marriage if you tell him the truth. Okay. Okay. I'll try. <laughs> <laughs> you know you are my blood. This money is now yours. And trust me, more will come more. Feel it first now. This is real money. Talk to me. Mm -hmm. Now tell me, how does it feel to own such a lot? I feel good, just that uh, I don't know what I did to deserve this amount of money. No, no, we are, we are my blood now. I must not have any reason to that for me. Uh, but I need a little further. Just one small favor like this. Mm. Uh, take this, eh? Uh, add it to the cook's food. Who? Edna now. I have to cook that calls herself Edna or whatever. I don't know. Just put them for her food. The food when she says she will chop. You understand? Why? What will you do to her? Okay, uh, it's a food supplement. It will make her, it will nourish her body, and at the same time, it will make her to start respecting me and seeing me as her boss. But you're not her boss. I'm not her boss. Like I'm not her. Uh, I'm not the owner of the house. But at the same time, I'm a man now. She is always respecting me. Mm. And then I'm not special. Just add it to her food. Yeah, the food will nourish your shop. Yeah. Uh, uh, don't forget, it's between us. Don't tell anybody. Agreement is agreement. Man. You know 
the great man. How? He's my uncle. Chimo. Dubebu. What did you say? When I first saw him, he warned me never to reveal his identity. That if I do, he was going to kill me. What you're saying? Hey, have you listened to what this little girl is saying? Honey, I'm shocked at what she's saying. Listen, woman. Tell me the truth, okay? Tell me exactly the truth. The accident. You're crossing my car. The accident. You coming to my house? Was it all planned up? You think I just planned everything? Sir. So how come? Sir, you know how I find myself here. He recently asked me to poison Auntie Edna here. What? Um, for now, I have made up my mind to get that criminal arrested. I must get two men arrested. Can you imagine that? That idiot, that bastard, is nowhere to be found in the compound. My friend just called me that he, he saw that idiot. He saw that bastard at the clubhouse. Can you imagine that? I just have to get him arrested right now. Okay. Get him arrested immediately. Nonsense. My husband. What? My husband, there, there is something I need to tell you. I, I don't know how to say it, but you have to listen to me. I... I kept this from you since I entered this house. They are all lies. I, they are all lies. Hey, hey listen. Listen, I, I mean, I will listen to whatever I have to say later. Right now, I've made up my mind to get that criminal arrested. That's the most important thing to me right now. Look at this man. You have to. No rich, no rich ever. No, 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 Young man, you have no right to say anything here or to get to the station. Officer, move him. I told you to forget this guy, but you never believed me. Have you seen it now? No, they forget. Trust your man. Have you seen it? I've been wanting to tell you this for long. 
Oh my god, which fruit me? I've been having this issue of bedwetting for years now. All my sickles ran away because of the same condition. My family and I decided to come down to the village to make things can turn around for me for good. But nothing changed. Everybody that came for me ran away. Your mother... Your mother saw me and chose me for you. Uh, my mother and I decided to keep it a secret. We hid the secret from her till after our marriage. I promised my mother that I was going to tell you the truth. But I was so scared. Not until I, I saw the baby. It happened that the baby is from my village and he's fully aware of my condition. When Dubin found out that he was not aware of my condition, he decided to use it against me. Dubin made me do despicable things. The only thing he did not do was to ask me to sleep with him. He made me store his documents. He asked me to steal one of your documents so I can raise millions for him. He was demanding too much and I don't know where else to get the money from. So I had to sell one of your property. What? You sold my property? I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry, I was too scared. I was scared that... Do you know in the truth that you're going to call off the marriage? I'm sorry. When I said no, I found out. She advised me to tell you the truth, but I was so scared of the truth. I was so scared of telling you the truth. Meaning, you were aware about this all this while? You were aware about this? Master, I am sorry. I am sorry. It wasn't in my place to tell you. I begged her to tell you. She was scared. I wanted it. I wanted it to come from her, let it come from the horse's mouth. I am sorry. I'm sorry, it's not her fault. It's not her fault at all. She actually wanted to tell you, but I told her that I was going to be the one to tell you. I'm so sorry I betrayed you. I'm so sorry. And I found out that. I was pregnant for you. I decided not to be given to the money again. Because I couldn't stand the deceit. I couldn't stand the betrayal. You've been but a good man and a good husband to me. I'm so sorry for everything. I'm sorry. 
please, I was bad. I'm so sorry. Please, my husband, find a place in your heart to forgive me. I'm so sorry, Miko. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, my husband, please. It's okay. You had every opportunity of telling me the truth. You had the opportunity of trusting that I would stand by you no matter your health challenge. But you chose betrayer instead. Let me tell you this. It is something I've never told anyone in this house before. My mother knew about your health condition. She told me herself. My mother told me about your health condition. Still, I made a decision to go on with the marriage despite your condition. I believe there was help out there. I believe we could get the cure out there. I wanted you to tell me yourself. I was willing to wait till you cluster the courage of telling me the truth yourself. Which is why I, 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 I overlook all, all, all the changing of bedsheet and my clothes at night. I knew all along. Yes. I knew about her health challenge. I, I guess you didn't trust me after all. I just didn't trust me enough. Stop, stop, stop. I'm sorry. I don't want to see my husband. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no.
Anye kwa nepe msicha msicha cha Kobata ni mungo Your wife is pregnant with your child. She doesn't deserve to be sent away. Who are you to tell me what to do and what not? You lost that privilege the very moment you chose to betray me. How? How? How did I betray you? You knew the truth all this while was chose to hide it from me. The only reason she is not in the police cell right now for selling my property was because of my unborn child. Fred, I'm not supposed to tell you anything. Even when I try to tell you, she pleaded with me to allow her process before telling you. She's an adult. She should know what is good and what is bad. She wouldn't have laid hands on my property. She wouldn't have laid hands on my property and sold it if you had protected my interest. Fred. You have to understand that I will not do anything to hurt you. I... Enough! Enough of this madness already. I thought you were still the Edna I used to know. The Edna that would tell me everything. The Edna that would always watch after my back. It's obvious I was, I was I was mistaken all along. You chose to betray me. You changed completely.
And now, leave my house. Leave my house and never return. I don't want to set my eyes on you again. Edna, leave my house. I do not trust you anymore. And there is no point pretending. But I am sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you in any way. Enough, Edna! I don't want to repeat myself. My brother. Okay. I don't suffer. Since that time where they carry me. And now where they release me. No, we release you. I didn't say sell since. But that one not be the problem. I beg, Oga I won't apologize to Oga. I won't tell Oga say madam no be bad woman. No. Now me the black man, madam, where make her begin steal Oga money to do. All those things are the bad. Everything don't come to normal. I gotta forgive you. I'm dead. People are dead now. We adopt child. Everything that don't know all those things. Not the past. So, past are rubbish. Our guy and madam dead together. Everywhere good. Everywhere balanced. It's the law. You see, Akrika, my brother, I know I wronged you in the past. Well, forgive me. While in cell, I give my life to Christ. Hmm? Yes, I repented. So what, what's in that one coming? As we speak, I am a new creature in Christ Jesus. So please, help a brother. Oh? I'll say you know, the way we won't take and that is out seven times. No, my point is to say, I, 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 I can't survive. You can't survive. Okay. You see, you can survive, man. You don't be mad. That, the, the, the first time I want to never enjoy you for this, I like to take this over. Now, don't and I'll come. Let's no, go. No, 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 no. I'm not a changed person. I'm a born again now. Mommy, Mommy, I think if I fight you, you don't like me. The paper celebrity gets mad. The Puba Kaliaga. The paper celebrity gets mad. The Puba Mawabia. Spending chop money. 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 Spending Top money spent on it. Celebrity gets mad. 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 Celebrity gets mad.